Hi and welcome to part two. Yay! <laughs> part two of Alone in the Dark. Please, full playthrough unedited, hence things are popping up. Uh, thanks for watching if you're watching on YouTube. See you in the future when you have fast forwarded to where the game starts. Uh, for those of you who are here in the live stream, thank you for watching the live stream. You cannot fast forward, so I'm gonna blab a little more for you. Sorry, not sorry. Uh, thank you everybody for arriving into the stream. Thank you for being here. Thank you Jubel for watching three streams in a streak. Thank you Kalman for gifting three subs. Thank you so much Kalman. Uh, Wee. I'm trying to make a nice intro for YouTube chat. I'm trying to make them feel like, oh yeah, this is nice things to watch. But we are, uh, we are behaving. Uh, yeah. Stop arriving by Roxy. <laughs> Thanks for arriving. Thank you, Trisha for the 31 bits. Thank you so much. Thank you and thank you, Kalma, for the three gifted soups. Thank you so much. Um. We're gonna make bakies today. No, we're not gonna make bakies, but we're gonna play Alone in the Dark, okay? Uh, we're gonna play Alone in the Dark, and this is a very interesting game. As I said earlier, this game is a remake of the classic game from the 90s that has kind of set the standard, I almost said. It kind of kicked the, the horror survival genre off, and uh, I've been hearing about this title for many for many years uh, as like a classic title and I'm so happy that it was being remade. Uh, I've been looking forward to this remake releasing for a long time and it's finally here. It came earlier this week and now we're playing it. So uh, without further ado, let's jump into the video game uh, and continue where we left off yesterday. And then we can recap a little bit story-wise for those of you who weren't here yesterday and would like to know what happened and you would like to know... Um, the the story mm, mm. 1992 game wait the 1992 game scared little you will a lot oh you will maybe you get the re redemption now then redemption can it be called that welcome to alone in the dark um heck you wasn't even born yet yeah i wasn't <laughs> I wasn't. However, um, now we are here. Now we are born. And now we are able to play this game. Uh, I'm very excited. Yeah, grab your flashlights, everyone. We're going exploring. Uh, what's up, Yars? Hello! It's more of a reimagination of the original one. First Alone in the Dark was horrifying. Okay, you think this one is a little more tame? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> um... I presume maybe they cannot make everything exactly true to the original, considering how much has changed in the like in the ways that you can do things. Uh, but if nothing else, I guess it's an homage or kind of remake to the game, to the OG. Uh, this game has been fantastic so far. We have only gotten to chapter two because I've been not that great at solving some of the puzzles. I chose to use the uh, setting for old school, which means that we're not getting a lot of hints to the puzzles. Uh, because I'm stubborn and I enjoy puzzles, but I was tearing my hair out a little bit yesterday. Um, but we did it! We managed to beat the puzzles that we struggled with, and now we know how the talisman works, yeah. So now, now we know that. Um, story recap for those of you who didn't catch the stream yesterday, but you would like to know what's going on. Um, we are playing as this person right here, Emily Hartward. Uh, basically, the game started off. Now, this is something I that, that I saw when I uploaded last night's VOD to YouTube. Because I was kind of like busy messing with my settings on Twitch. So I missed what they said in the start. But basically, Emily Hartward is a person who seems to have... Um, I don't know, she called it like a family curse? And that um, a lot of her family members um, end up um, losing their minds or something like that, she said. Um, and uh, her uncle is one of the people who is seemingly is right now uh, not really like... He's like struggling with something and it seems to be that he's talking about some devil or something that is chasing him or following him around um 
and uh, she would like to go and talk to him and hopefully find out what's actually going on, what this family curse is about, if there is some way to kind of prevent what's going on before maybe she suffers the same fate. Um, I missed out on that part yesterday when the stream started. I apologize because I was a little bit distracted from the settings that I was messing with on the side. Um, but that was really interesting to, to hear about that. Um, with her... Um, to go investigate uh, the uncle or to, to talk to the uncle, we have basically been traveling to this old uh, villa, an old mansion, where our uncle is staying at some sort of... Um, what was it called? It's not really a resort. Um, it's like... Um, for uh, for people who... Uh, they, they're offered like... therapy and... Um, different evaluations maybe? Um, for people, uh, some so somebody said that they were there, they just needed a break, so they went over there. So I'm not sure what it classifies as, but this is all taking place in the 30s, 1930s. Um, with her to go visit her uncle in this mansion, we have taken a friend, or I don't know how they know each other, a detective, a private detective, uh, played by David uh, Harbour. I don't know what his character is called. Mr. Barnaby, something like that, Barky B. Um, and in the start of the game, we actually get to choose which character we want to play as. I picked Emily to start with, but I've heard that it is recommended that you play both characters so that you get to see the entire thing. Um, so, yeah, they put Hotper in the game, right, Hairless? So, um, very exciting. I, I think knowing what I know now with the intro that I missed yesterday, I think I did a good choice in picking Emily first. I do feel like it feels good to start out with her since it's like her family story and then it feels like Hopper might be a side character but we will see. They have not spent that much time together so we are definitely alone in the dark in that sense. Alone and um, yeah I guess we will see whenever we're done with her story we will play through his side. I guess it's a bit like Resident Evil also. Remember when you play like the different chapters there's like the Leon and the Claire and the Gil and every all of those. So um, that's that's exciting. I'm excited to check out how, how they kind of tie together with each other. But I'm happy we started with Emily. We've made it to chapter two only. After 420 hours of playing. Uh, not very impressive, I think, but uh, hopefully it will go faster this day, today, going forward in the chapters. Mm. Uh, any questions, chat? Any questions? Anything I missed? Any important information? Oh yeah, I forgot to mention, the uncle that we are looking for is gone. Um, we are asking people that are staying here, or staff that are in the mansion, and all of them are like, no, we don't know, we haven't seen him. It seems like he is gone, but he's like gone in like some different place. He's basically in the dark place. He's like Alan Wake. He's somewhere. Uh, everything is just gone. Uh, and we seem to like be facing into his reality somehow um, because we end up in weird places we keep traveling through time and space and like end up meeting monsters that are like made out of roots I don't know it's a mess we don't really know what's going on but hopefully we will make some, some sense of it uh, tonight that's about it um Coordinator, thank you. Yeah, I will do my best finding all the collectibles, definitely. Also, a uh, nerve agent. Thanks for coming in. And you're the gifty. Thanks for joining. Um, also, Lisa. Hi. Thank you. Thanks to at Om Su for my sub gift. Huggy hug lurking as usual. Have a good time with this game, Hekami. I really liked it. Huggy okay. flower, Huggy lurk. You finished it already? I'm not surprised. You're you're much uh, faster and much more like. You you're much more better at making progress in video games than I am. I'm, a little bit. You know, I take time. <laughs> it takes time for me to get forward, but we get there in the end. Please, thank you so much for coming in and sharing your sub mods. Seven out of twelve, and thirty-four in total. Thank you so much, Liz. Happy lurking. Thank you for coming by. Thank you so much. I'm glad you had a good time with this. And uh, yeah, I, I liked it so much already. Uh, I like it a lot already, so um, I'm stoked to get back into it. 
This game is only 5-10 hours. It said on how long to beat, 10-ish hours for leisure. I'm usually on the leisure run. But I heard that you can, you should play through each character once. So I'm probably gonna end up playing 20 hours, I guess. <laughs> well, we'll do our best. Either way, take care, welcome in. Come in. Okay, without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into the game. I am going to connect my uh, controller. We did establish yesterday that for me personally, I, in this game, apparently play better with a controller. Not aiming. Aiming is not going very good with a controller. But all the other things, the button presses, work a little bit better. <laughs> More talisman puzzles! Yeah, now that we know how the talisman works, I'm open for new. I'm open for new talisman puzzles. Okay. Yay! Time to continue. Kalman, thank you for gifting sub to take guy. Thank you. Take care. Welcome back to being subscribed. Enjoy the emotes. Okay, are you all ready? We're clicking continue. We're playing on standard difficulty, by the way. I don't mind playing on hard, but the game said like this is the intended difficulty. And I thought, hey, I'm here for the ride, not for the struggle. And I kind of got a little bit wrecked yesterday anyway, so. Yeah. <laughs> uh, let's go ahead and continue. Chapter 2. Also, hi Infinity Simplex, welcome! When we ended the game last night, we actually had one of the moments where we did travel through time and space. Uh, we were hanging out in here inside of the mansion and suddenly we were out here. Suddenly we are in the swamps of Louisiana, somewhere outside, probably in the past. Um, it seems like we're having one of those moments where we just don't uh or we just don't know what's going on we're suddenly somewhere else and in these moments is when we're usually meeting uh enemies so we gotta be a little careful but uh we shall we shall yeah hope for the best i bet hard is more like the old game with monsters that are nearly unkillable yeah probably i feel like old school games usually were very very hard um, I know that when we played Resident Evil 1, I played on hard and people said that that was the difficulty, that was the original one. Or that was like normal or something. And then you can play it again and you would unlock even harder one. But my aim, yeah, my aim makes up for the, for the, for the difficulty, the decrease that we have <laughs> today. And also, um... Uh, you know, I've gotten pretty wrecked still. Yeah, they took a lot of bullets, a lot of headshots for us shooting the monsters before. What about the little static and noise? I don't know what that is. Okay, mm, amazing stories. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, like five or six, yeah. A lot of a lot of shots. Hi Team the Sorcerer! Welcome in! Thanks for joining! I'm glad I found a stream that's guaranteed not to have sp spooky ghosts in it. Yeah, yeah, yeah! Really friendly and happy here, Tim. Um everything will be so fine. Yeah. Oil rig report. So we're what we're finding in the game, we're trying to find like little collectibles. The more collectibles we find, uh, the more we, like, we can unlock more info in the game to the story. Uh, but there's also clues like this. Here is a clue uh, that can help us in our search for our uncle. So let's read this oil rig report. May 1923. Monday. All okay. Money. Ready for delivery. A Monday. Maintenance. Oil pump must be serviced. Any tampering causes large spills unless properly forestalled. Tuesday. Shipment delayed but delivered. Maintenance. Service bridge close to broken. Wednesday. Prospectors reluctantly agreed to show the burial mound to Mr. Hartwood, a painter, who read about our finds in the papers. Mr. Hartwood? To return tomorrow and try to find a way inside. Thursday. Wait. But Mr. Hartwood's efforts delayed. Mr. Hartwood? Hartwood seemed nervous about his presence. 
Hopwood promised not to return to the compound. Instead, he has taken up an offer by L'Officier, the riverboat what? captain, who means to pilot him to the site tomorrow morning. Hopefully, that's the end. Work can resume. Maintenance. The bridge from the oil tower to the bayou has collapsed. Sabotage suspected. This is the devil that guides us now. What was that? This is the devil that... But, but, Mr. Hartman, do they mean... Hartman? <laughs> Dr. Emil Hartman. Uh, Mr. Hartwood, do they mean our... Uh... Do they mean our uncle? Hmm. Hmm. Do, do they mean our uncle? Because we are called Emily Hartman, right? But this is 1923 in here on an oil ring? But that they worked on an oil ring? Do we know our uncle's past? Yeah, Yimri. Yimri is our uncle. Hmm. Ah! Just open this with nothing in. Do you hear the, the flies? Whoa, whoa! Yay. It's a raid! It's a party! Whoa, whoa! <laughs> Mika! Excuse you! How dare you! Oh my gosh, readers, welcome in! Hi, everybody! Welcome! Hi! Thanks for watching. Hello, Nina Dark! I know! Mika already played this, right? I presume she did. She was in on this whole thing. Super cool thing. Welcome in, readers! Hi! Thanks so much for joining us! Hello! If we haven't met before, hello! You can call me Hickey. I'm from Sweden, just like Mika. And uh, we are hanging out here playing some video games. We're playing Alone in the Dark. Mika probably already finished it. Uh, she flew. What, she, what do you mean? She beat it really fast? Oh, you played it but didn't finish it because of Dragon's Do Oh my gosh! Yeah, oh yeah, because that came out uh, also this week. Oh no! Well, I hope you get to play to play through it fully because I'm having a blast. I think this is awesome. But this is like also right up my alley. I really enjoy the puzzle games. I really enjoy um, running around trying to find like little clues or figure stuff out. Um, so uh, I guess uh, I guess uh, yeah. I guess maybe I'm biased. Anyway. Hopefully she gets to finish it at some point, but also I hope she's having fun with Dragon's Dogma. I heard I heard a lot of people are having a lot of fun with this game. Um, thanks so much for the follows. Thank you for coming in. Chat if you're in here and you're not following Miss Mika. You're missing out on a Swedish superstar uh, playing a lot of Dragon's Dogma recently, but there's also a lot of other games going on over there. She's uh, very good at video games, playing a lot of different, different kinds of games, um, playing them very goodly. Um, thank you so much for coming in, everybody. Thank you. Hello. Welcome. Yeah, we're playing this. This is day two, but I'm only on chapter two because I might have struggled with um, the talisman puzzle yesterday. So, <laughs> But we're just getting started. Welcome in. If you're coming in with the red and you're uh, reading out, reading in and saying hi and living, thanks for taking the time to come and say hi with the red. Thank you very much. Uh, if you feel like sticking around, feel free to grab a seat. We're just getting started, as I said. We literally just launched up the game, like, 10 minutes ago. Um, we just recapped a little bit and uh, check where we're, where we're at. Um, hi, Hodor! Welcome! Is this even heck if I can't make the things that I'm from Ikea land? I paused it for now, Hodor, because I wanted to make sure that we got, like, introduced to the game um, in a good, like immersive way it worked great yesterday i felt so immersed it really it really felt uh, like i understood what was going on um so uh, it helped against the distract distractedness uh anyway thank you so much for the follows thank you for coming in shocky thank you for watching through the streams on a streak thank you uh again chat if you haven't followed miss Mika already please do so like comment subscribe like comment subscribe on her channel it's great um she's very cool she plays a lot of awesome games uh Go like, comment, subscribe. You're gonna enjoy it. Thank you, Mika. Uh, please go like, uh, go like, comment, subscribe. No, please go read and run if you need to. I know there is uh, probably food time. 
uh, congrats on your move by the way so exciting uh, just saw like the glimpse of that your picture you posted online um, exciting <laughs> a dining room or a table in a room that's all I have seen so far I don't know if you've shown anything more of the house but <laughs> exciting I hope uh, you enjoy the move and hopefully you have gotten out of the um, moving boxes that always takes like forever um, she has new plates. New plates to eat dinner of let's go. I love I love that kind of stuff. When you're like when you move and you're like, oh I can I can get some um like plates or some uh what are they called? The glasses. Uh, and, and like a everything new about moving is always so exciting. I got a bunch of plates, heck yeah. Um uh, plates <laughs> Are we are we grown ups yet? Is that what that means? Excited about plates? Hmm. Well, anyway. Oh, oh my gosh, I heard about the cooking stream, but I missed it. I have to check the vault. I have to check the vault. I missed out on that. Uh, I might have been sleeping. <laughs> I'm on a bit of a DJ uh, sleep schedule, but I almost said life schedule. Uh, same other things, I guess. Anyway, uh, please go take care of yourself, Mika. Uh, go uh, do your things. Yay! Eat, sleep. Um, and anybody else who came in with the red also, uh, thank you for taking the time to say hi. Thank you very much. Why am I- why are they empty? Um, if you want to stick around, feel free to do so. We're playing through this game, uh, first time. Yay! We only started the game for the first time yesterday. Um, bon appetit, Miga, take care. Thank you for reading us. Thank you so much for thinking about us. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yay! Um, Kalman! Thanks so much for gifting Isu, but to cancel and to hold her. Treasure Quarry also gifting a sub to Akis. Enjoy the gifted subs, everybody. Thank you so much. Thank you for the gifted sub. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for spreading some uh, uh, popcorn to the, the visitors coming in reading. Um, as I said, we're only on day two and we're only in chapter two. So we got uh, plenty of uh, things to do and explore, but um, I'm sure it will go great. Yeah. Um. Also, hey, random red, welcome in. I'm the gatekeeper. There's so many of you. I had the uh, tr trouble keeping up. Mikarids are powerful. But uh, welcome in. Feel free to um say hi again if you wanted to say hi and I missed it. <laughs> That'll be great. Yeah, yeah it's this is gonna go great. Um. I need the key. Hey Liam, what's up? Wasn't last read? I'm a pilot. Pi you're a pilot? And a movie booth and an affiliate streamer. Well, Liam, that sounds awesome. I actually have a pilot in the family as well. Uh, making awesome, uh, cool uh, profession. I need the key. Yeah, we can't unlock that. And uh, GG, movies are cool. I mostly watch TV series. And uh, I hope you're having fun streaming. Um, Cheshire, thank you for that gift as well. Also, Kalman, thank you so much. So we're in this weird dream state. I don't really know what's going on. But we're looking for our uncle. And I'm sure he's gonna be here somewhere, right? Okay, we need to find a key, I guess, to get in. Through the door. Boobies, hi. Have you played the original Hodor? I never played it. I'm so happy that they remade it all, so I'm able to do this kind of, uh, kind of, I don't know, it, it feels like a classic title that everybody should have played. For those of you who didn't know and you're in from my stream, Mika actually was part of a, like, a special event for the launch of this game, uh, where she went to, uh, I think to England, the England, uh, for like, um, kind of an IRL, uh, escape room kind of thing they made a video about it very cool uh maria was in there too and a bunch of uh, other creators super cool what what am i what am i doing using this for do i need to use it <gasps> I, I thought i could put it down and use it later but it just exploded how strong fists do we have just tossed a brick on the ground and it broke. Okay. Uh, well, it's not really going very well for us in the stealth department anyway, so... Might as well not. 
Yeah, <laughs> can't use the... Oh, there's another one here. So I think that... I I might be wrong, but I think that we're supposed to be a bit stealthy. Locked. Because we find a lot of throwables in a lot of places. It feels like uh, The Last of Us a little bit. But... Um, I haven't been really good at being stealthy. We kind of run in and... Just... Uh, shoot. <laughs> You can went to England. Yeah, to haunted house with the Annie. Right, right. Yeah, again. Also, hey, yeah, again. That's what it was. I saw it. was a bunch of videos from it. Healing. Bullets. Thank you. Can I unlock this? Okay. If ever we need this shortcut, it is now open. Solid Snake did not taught, taught you stealth? I haven't played any games with snakes. Oh, this is the one, maybe, perhaps. Yeti key, what does Yeti mean? Isn't that a snowman? The, ab the, abno abdom <laughs> the ab 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 abnormal sn snowman? Rigga, oh, Yeti, okay. Um. Almost. Mm. Yeti. Yeah, yeah, Yeti. Those ones. Look, that one. That 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 one emo there. That's Yeti. <laughs> Abominable snowman. Yeah, yeah, that one. I guess we could go back there? Or we go forward already. Ah. Hello? Uh we're just not hmm, there's something missing. Okay, apparently something is missing. We do still get some hints. Can we jump off here? Maybe not. Okay, this is fine. Doho, welcome in! How are you always getting golden kappas? Do you... Is there... Do you go to hype train the channels that are having the golden kappa train? Hi, the dude! Welcome! Are these bugged or do you think there should, should not be anything here? A yeti is a structure that projects from land into water. Projecti. No, I thought they were related. Um, so it needs to be... Yeah, well, we call that Brigga in Swedish. Like... Uh, like when there's like wooden stuff sticking out. Or yeah, or a pier, I guess. Maybe a little less fancy than Pier. Oh, Belia. Hey, is that blood? <laughs> Surely somebody was just repainting, right? So they're they're just they're just repainting the house, right? All good. Nothing too bad. Bridge lever. Okay. Oh, we were... Here we go. Repenting with blood. No, I think. Uh... What do you mean? Fu I'm full in my drinking. Okay, let me. Let me drink one and then f that again. How convenient that somebody's placing down all of these healing potions. Yeah, very lots of ketchup. Very lots. School also to you. I heard sexes. Yeah, the, the original Alone in the Dark trilogy is currently 59 cents on GOG. Is this gurgling? Oh, do you think it's the frog from the intro yesterday? Mm. 
Hello? Is it from the Pudel? No, 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 no! Oh my gosh, it's amnesia! Oh no, oh yeah, what is that? Oh, okay, okay, yeah, we're running, we're running. Can it go on land? Was that an alligator? Uh, that was a, yeah, it was a funny looking dog. I was thinking for the five 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 beats. Do you think it was a creeper? We're gonna make bakeys today. I we're not making bakeys today. <laughs> I think I think we'll uh, we'll uh, we'll save that for another day. Okay, I guess we can't go out there. We have to lay it and not go back. Oh. It worked. Yay! Are we able to go upstairs though? Something lootable there. Maybe on the other side. Baking. <gasps> ah! The ball stairs! <laughs> that was an unnecessary yump scare. Um. I think. <laughs> I, they didn't need to put that there. But I guess it has been a while since we last had a scary. I am so sorry, Champy. I didn't mean to scare you. Yeah. Good morning to anybody who just woke up from that. Welcome. Hello. We are um, playing uh, scaries. Can I only have one? What? Why is everything we open now closed? Nay. Everything we open is empty. Can't take that drink. Do I have to drink again? The whole thing for the 120 beats! Leftovers. I can't have beats laying around in your beat wallet without using them. No, no, there was a loot behind there! Ow! In the back! Ow! This can hurt in the morning. Do I have to find it? Oh my gosh, oh no. It's got one heck of a loud uh, noise for being so tiny. Well, that's how easy it was. That was it? Yeah, it looked much scarier than it was. <laughs> hmm. The big earring uh, it was. It was indeed. I don't know how to get back in. It looked like there was a loot there. Maybe later? Ah! Oh no, more. Oh no, okay. Maybe they are just preparing us for something. Bigger to go. Night, 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 night. I already ran out of ammo. Oh no. Oh no. Yep, okay. What? The both of them at the same time? They're cheating! Admin, I would like to file a complaint. This is a 2v1. Yeah, we picked normal because they said, like, this is how we intend the game to be played. But if it's getting too easy, I kind of feel like we should up the difficulty. I can break this. I just need something to hit it with. Wait, really? Wait, can I kindly... Okay. I think it's really a little bit. I would like to check the houses first. If there's some, there is nothing. Have I gone a bug? Shovel weapon. <gasps> no. Is this a breakable item or is this forever? No. Oh, never mind. The temporary. Just thought you always chose the hardest. We usually pick the hard. 
We can change difficulty at any point in the game though. But now we're not even seeing any loot here, so I'm wondering if it's not just on hard. They're all breakable. I was hoping that we would get a um, like a good uh, melee weapon that we can use at all times. Like a melee weapon that lasts a permanent one. Shovel is a groundbreaking invention. Hey! <laughs> yeah, again, you are correct. It's not for nothing they made a shovel museum in Fallout, right? Best museum I've ever been to. Hey, Boyd Girl, what's up? Welcome in! And Terrific! Hi! Thanks for joining us tonight. Okay, I guess I'm just gonna run. Maybe? Did I miss something here? <gasps> An ore. <laughs> Why are there so many melee items? Do they mean I should melee this door? Oh! Oh! Okay, let me go pick something else up because I feel like this is gonna break now. Turn back. A little, it takes a little bit. It feels like my character is a little slow to control. I feel like we're relatively fast. Uh, if we play, press sprint. It feels like we're slow, but also relatively fast. <laughs> what is this noise? Is this the sound of oil drinking? Oh, yeah, it was. This one's input lag? No, it just feels like I don't have great control over it. Oh my gosh, there's a person sitting right there. Okay, we're just gonna take a sneak. Hopefully they cannot hear us. I mean, see us. Hello. We having a good day. Are we at like camp? Kind of worried. <laughs> Are you hiding anything over here? Can we pick that thing up there? Do I want to walk past it? I think the game has some frame drops here and there. It looks a bit of lag. Yeah, um, I'm playing the PC version. <gasps> I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt you. I just wanted to see if I get loot over here. Never mind. I'm running. Um, I had a... Uh, I'm playing the PC version. I'm so sorry. I kind of didn't mean to attack you. I'm very sorry. I apologize. I apologize. Um, a lot of people on Steam said that it's uh, it's not fully smooth yet on computer for a lot of people. So if you're thinking of buying it, maybe pr console version is a safe bet. Get the other shovel. Eh? Was there one in here? No, nothing in here. Oh my gosh, look! A d moose! <laughs> Now that you had the Sololology lesson today, at on TikTok, I hope you know all about animals. Okay, I'm just gonna run. Music! <laughs> oh, what is that? Squishing through? Wait, I don't want to miss out on any loot. Beautiful music, piano time. Mm. We can barge through doors. Mm. 
Gio, I hope you're well. Welcome in. Do, 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 do. Yeah, piano time. I am full. I have a limited amount of bullets I can have. But I always run out. But why to sneak? Okay, it kind of feels like the game wants me to go over there. Wait, game, I don't want to sneak it. Good night, I hope you feel bad. <gasps> Good night, Faber Milker. Sleep well. I'm gonna go through here. Just squish through and see where we go. Yeah. The game is playing you off. <laughs> Good night, Faber Milker. Sleep well. We shall catch you in the morning and in the boat. This is a yam. I've noticed this game had a bit of an X-Files feel. Ooh, if X-Files was set in like 80 years earlier. 80 years earlier. Yeah, I mean... Yeah. There is... Vibes. And... Things. Uh, and that's a good thing. Excuse me, bro, can you give me your... Ow! Headshot! I'm trying to... Excuse me! Can I open door faster? No, 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 no! Okay, because you occupied. Go, go, get... <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm losing my health! Eat, eat, drink! This is good. Oh, no, we're fighting on the porch! Oh, God. One arm shot was all it took! Okay, that wasn't great, but it could have been worse. We still didn't die. It's fun to see that in a video game. Yeah, for sure. I think you've done a great job with this game in general. I like the overall feeling. Uh, what was that? Oh, it's a lagniappe. Gazing statuette. Hmm. Gazing. Uh, ah, well, thank you. Good night. Thanks for hanging out. Thank you. Thank you. And uh, we'll see you when we see you. Why are there scary things in this game? Hodor, uh, you know, sometimes things are just scary. Keyboard and mouse, maybe, for the headshots? Yeah, the, I played with keyboard and mouse earlier, but I kept getting confused about, like, how to press heal. <laughs> I thought it would be easier with a controller. And honestly, to be fair, most of the controls are easier with a controller. It's just the aiming that kind of sucks. I, I suck at aiming. Um, but um, it, it, I, I think it's worth it for, for the rest. The rest of the game feels very control friendly. Controller friendly. Look, we found two out of three of Beast of Burden. We found the Gazing statuette. And also the mummified cat. Which is a little bit sad. There's something else. Honestly, it kind of looks like the head of a moose. I almost said a cow. Right? With like two horns, maybe? Hmm. Death of the author? No! Don't tell me that the author! Remember somebody was like having a writer's block? And they were in here? Have they... Have they... Go are they died? I wonder if the empty things are places that we will find items when we play as Hopper. Maybe. Alan! Aiming on controller tends to be harder, which is why a lot of games have aim assist for controller players. Yeah, that's really good. I like when there is like people have choices, there's accessibility, and people can uh, play the way that they prefer. Whichever way works best for them. I also think it sometimes helps out with some aim assist for. We've been in here, right? Yes. Just for helping. <gasps> oh no. Okay. 
There's scaries here. So they say I should sneak now? Maybe that means that I can actually sneak? Ah, Papu, you scared me. Heggy wiggle, heggy wiggle. Heggy wiggle, heggy wiggle. Hapako, thank you so much for the seven months of being so big. Thank you so much. Happy seven months. <laughs> Happy seven months! Thank you for the seven months, sub. Welcome in where we are sneaking. Oi. Do these ever stop? RT. Where do you want to throw it? Over there. What? It didn't even make a sound. <laughs> is this place on fire? Or why is everything happening? Is that moths? I'm just gonna keep on sneaking. Hope for the best. A molotov? What? Oh, he plopped out. Oh my gosh, am I actually stealthing? Chat, I did it. I'm a stealthy. I can't believe I did it. I did a stealth. They're pumping up the oil? Yeah, but there's like a fire up there. Or oh, is that supposed to be there? Is that how they pump it up? I don't know how oil things work. And these are bats. Maybe? No. Moths? Very big ones. No, I have to stealth more. I was so proud that I managed to stealth the first part. Oil bats. Yeah, the, the, the famous oil bats. That gather around your oil pump. You know. Like it does. You know. Like uh, like what happens. Are you supposed to follow these little lamps? Damn it, there has to be a way to get to the other side. Oh, I have to grab something first. Okay. Okay, I probably want to go to the right. Why does it not make sound? <laughs> we throw the things and they don't make any sound? Oh my gosh, there's one right there. Why is it not attacking? Really? Well, um, that's one way to create a forest fire, I guess. I'm not sure if we should feel proud about this. Uh, but, um, good job, chat. The floor is lava, quite literally. <laughs> the floor is quite literally lava, and I feel like we may or may not have created a natural uh, disaster but don't tell anyone it was definitely not our fault <sighs> now what yeah now what <laughs> we got a seat line barbecue hey, at least you're here did you surpass me a lot now did you manage to catch up tough clothes Okay, that's a clue. Or key item. Just don't look down, Emily. Yeah, don't look down. Oh, use the tough clot to slide down, really? Does this work? How? <laughs> 
Woohoo! We just a little close. Right. We. Right, literally, yeah, we. We. Easy. Care, welcome! I just finished Alan Week. Now I'm gonna go to sleep, but I wanted to pass by. You don't care? Wait, you mean you played the first one? Thanks so much for coming by. Thank you for your 60 stream streak. I hope you had a great time finishing Alan Wake. What a fantastic game that is. Or franchise, I should say. Alan Wake 2 is next. Let's go. I'm excited. Have you played Control? Hello? What do alligators sound like? Is this the sound of alligators? <laughs> ah! That is not a gillator! <laughs> it was an earwig. That was for sure an earwig. Did you see it had the horns? The little pincers? Oh my gosh, I'm being chased by a freaking ginormous big earwig. Mega earwig. Not a glator. It was not a glator. Oh, is this people? Part of, part, part of this sounds like a dog. Well, you know when a dog is done sniffing at you? It's like, hmm, who are you? And it sniffs a little bit. And then it goes... <laughs> you know, it just breathes out. Sniffs outwards. Sniffa. That's what they do, and then it... I don't want to snot on your, microf on your microphone. On the microphone. I don't think gators make much of a sound. You, you, I, I think it was maybe a little bit too noisy for an alligator. Jeremy mentioned in his book. Oi, I am having some legs. Oh, oh, legs. The hateful mound. Oh. I think it sounds rather peaceful. Hi, Zero. Welcome. Oh, no. Cuts in. That means bad things. Or is a cool shrine? That's getting the smells back uh, back out. Is that why they do it? They, like contained all the smells while they sniffed. Is that Jeremy, a flashlight? You dropped your. <gasps> Why, why were we talking like that? Marcus, <gasps> get off of me! What are you doing here? This is trying Marcus. to find my uncle. Jeremy is your <laughs> uncle. Could you please? We gotta stop meeting people like this, getting Thank beaten you. up, and then they say, "Wait a minute, and is that Harwood? you?" You don't remember me? I remember you, Mister Bois. Tabois. Brother, brother, I thought they were married. I suppose he hadn't found Jeremy either then. We spread out to find him. Can I have this? I'm trying to get to Tarawea. What is this? Fine, believe the rest. I just want Jeremy to come looking. Looking for what? We have to leave before it comes inside. What? Where? Come quick. But how long have these people been in here? I'm so confused. The same with Baptiste. How long have they been? <laughs> No, 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 no. Oh my gosh, I thought I was gonna have to do quick time events. Just cuts in. That's why. God damn, my soul. My soul. <sighs> and just like that, we're back. Uh, I'm back at Dorsetto. 
We are! Lucky we didn't save that for yesterday, remember? We were like, hmm, should we continue? Did we just jump out of the floor? I used to have a PS2 style controllers and still got my N64. What? Old school gamer holder. What an old school gamer. What did we just pick up with us? His briefcase? <gasps> Left holding the bag. Find Yenner Remy's bag. Key item. A lit knife. It's intended for painting, but it's thin enough to slide through the crack of a door. Ah, okay, I get it. Reflections on the power of the verb in certain text. Reflections on the power of the verb in certain Story text. Story time! By Juan Luis Jorge. To act is in itself divine. Mm. Even the slightest movement of our hand is evidence of our soul in motion. Yet our free will is so easily overwhelmed by the dullness of everyday life. Our actions become rote and rigid, in spite of luxury and comfort. True divinity yeah. is found in the choice of leaving the stage where we all perform. People who discover this freedom unexpectedly will be struck by the tarot of this revelation the is and become result. paralyzed, or worse, turn to suicide. However, if you are able to weather that storm, you will discover that there is a divine path beyond that. Yeah, take notes. There will be a there test is a on chance this. chance to dismantle stance. your destiny and make something new. Something that hasn't been planned for or predestined. There is difficulty in explaining this type of acting as it transcends our everyday choices. This isn't some banal decision choosing one career over the other, or even who I should marry. Leaving the stage. No matter how, isn't a matter of course correction. It's a rejection of the story that the creator is telling. Dang. Why are they showing the Taurus over here? The great Libra... Library? Taurus, the great library. There's a library inside of the Taurus. <laughs> Oops, sorry. I'm hoping that Discord stole the answers and that I can get in on the cheating. What do you mean? Cheating on the tests? In here? Sitting room key. Oh, he had all of this in his bag. Sitting room. Which one was that? Sitting room. Lotus room. Well, at least we can go in here now because we have the slide under the door thing. Wait, Erlish, how far did you, you go? You go further at least? It worked. Wow! How did that lock the door? How did it lock the door to have something underneath it? <gasps> it played. Hi, indecision. Whoa. Hi, indecision. I don't have everything I need. I don't have everything I need. Okay. Starship power. School. Thank you for reminding me to drink. Chat is cheating on the test. Indy. Tell them off. Barlow lens instructions. The Barlow lens instructions. Okay. To double the magnification of your telescope, simply fit this Barlow lens to your instrument. Then operate this... the fine tuners to adjust the distance between your lenses. Oh. This is easily done while looking through your eyepiece. Mm. Simply search for a position where your picture is clear and appears flat. Hi. When correctly Choo -choo. tuned, your telescope should present a clear picture with magnificent magnification. Magnificent magnification? I can't believe it. Um, I guess I don't have that lens yet. Talked about it as if we had it already. Cellar key. Oh, yo, yo, we're getting a lot of keys here. Dang, yeah, grab your binoculars. Boom, pass by. Good night, I hope you feel bad. Good night, just good. I hope you feel good. <laughs> We got it! We got it! The 
dog crawler like Nyape that we were looking for yesterday. This is uh, what we were talking about and we were like, this will unlock the cupboard? No, the cabinet for the... I think for the shotgun, right? And, and I thought it looked like something else and you said it's probably a dog crawler. Bailey, it says on it. Lost, look! Lost children! We got it! Three out of three is the first one we got! Unlocks the shotgun cabinet. Do we just go to it now? Okay, right. Bravo, everyone. Good job, everyone. <laughs> Good job, chat. Finding that out. Um, I'm not entirely sure how we're gonna use, like, a dog cooler. And a mummified cat. What was it? We're gonna use... Oh, never mind. A dog collar, a rubber stamp, and a fountain pen. Somehow we're gonna build that together into a key that opens the shotgun cabinet. I guess anything is possible. Yeah, with a shotgun we don't need to aim. That is very true. Just open now. Oh, now this will come in handy. Yeah. Shotgun weapon. Is that forever? It is. Look. Uh, look. Look. Look underneath me. There is now to the to downwards is the shotgun. Will I start finding shotgun shells now? Maybe. A pistol to the right. Okay, nice. Let's go! Dogs, colors, metal, the fountain's pen, stick, and the stamps. Rubber. Suddenly! A key. I'm, I think that's how we put it together, Indy. Yeah. That's what happened. Okay, there's still one puzzle there, and I don't think... Do we have what we need to go to Lottie? I'm not sure. Okay, Erlish is having his spoiler face on. You mean blocked? Why is it smoky from the underneath? The heck? Is that what we get for smoking? Remember that when we came in here the first time and we were just like smoking a cigarette without even saying hi to the person sitting there? This is what happens when you walk around smoking cigarettes where you shouldn't be and suddenly fires. My game glitched. <laughs> oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh no. <laughs> because I had like at least a little glitch before we got there and then and then the whole game changed. I'm so sorry, chat, I didn't mean to scream on your ear holes. I got really screwed. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, well, alright. It seems like we've traveled in time and space again. Alan Wake kind of jumps here, yeah. I am so sorry, I literally, I literally screamed into the microphone. Okay, well now, okay, that's fine. Now we've gotten here somewhere. Cool. Yeah. Huh? huh? I don't hear anything anymore. Like, kind of spoil it. What? No? I got extra scared because of the lag. Because I thought the lag turned my game into something weird. You know what I mean? The lag made me scared. Do I have a map? Wait, what? I'm here now? Still in this house? 
I should probably heal. All of a sudden, I've used like almost all my healing. Yes! <laughs> Is everything normal now? Okay, that wasn't so bad. It wasn't? I don't know about you, but I think that was not so good. It was scary without the lag. It was instant. Well. I probably would have scared, gotten scared either way. I would have, would have screamed either way. But that one I did scream. Uh, I'm sorry about your ears, chat. I'm very sorry. You have the game on an SSD? Yes, I do. Um, I don't. I don't know why there is lags every once in a while. <sighs> okay, bolted door. What did we the just dream get? of the grave under the chenier suddenly vanished, and Emily found herself back at Desetto. Yeah. Instead of Jeremy, she found Lottie. I did. Who, just like her brother Baptiste. Oh. Reminded her of John, who died so bravely in the war. Died? She pushed her painful memories out of her mind and returned to her investigation. Young she still Marcus? needed to figure out what to do with the boiler. Oh yeah, the boiler. Okay, that's where we're going. Uh, Yon, is that Yon Marcus? It was Yon Marcus. Oh no! So they got engaged and then he was like, let's get married when I get back. And he never came back. And that way she's correcting everybody when they say, Oh yeah, it's you, Miss Mrs. Marcus. Oh me 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 bloopers. Menu. Sad. Uh we go downstairs to the boiler room now. There's yes we do, I think. Unless, what else items did we get? Find the boiler mentioned in Compass book. I guess the other keys will come in handy at some other point. See, they, we get this little bit of a lag when we enter a new area and then it looks fine. So sad. But true. Oh, here's the cellar key. My gosh, that's huge. What's that stain? Looks like some kind of rot. The rot is here now, too. I don't know what Rochi means. Pieces of blood. This was not here when we were here last time, was it? I played the first Alone in the Dark years ago and never passed the game after it came out. Yeah, I, f I feel like it, it can be really tough. Older games, like back in the days, games were really hard to beat, I feel like. Uh, they were not only difficult in terms of combat and stuff, but also like puzzles and everything. I would never be able to hear so sad, but still without thinking, but true. I Hello, know, radioactive. Oh, I saw a piece of the plate that Liza broke. I think she's been hiding them. She's oh. not very good at it. She just chucked it into the little room with all the tools behind the boiler. I left it there. I didn't want to embarrass her by picking it up while she was looking. We went upstairs instead and played backgammon. I let her win. Backgammon. Because she's so unhappy. The piece looked like the one on display in Cassandra's oh. room. You know about that one already, right? Or is your eyesight really that fuzzy? I hope you don't feel bad about your glasses. You only look stupid when you squint. Maybe what? if you had more eyes, you would see these things. I wish you had all the eyes you needed. Your best and favorite guest, Grace. Children. 
Oh children, the most brutally honest people on the planet. <laughs> um, okay, well. Um, right, is this Mr. Wits? That's the one we have seen before. I wish you had more eyes. Okay, well. Hopefully he did not end up getting more eyes and turn into one of the monsters we've been fighting around with. It's another one of those plates for the telescope. It's oh! Also broken and missing some pieces. Oh shoot, okay, we can't find more pieces yet. Broken valve. Okay. We need to find the things to turn that off. Yeah, exactly. Ominous foreshadowing. <laughs> I wish you get more eyes. Um, maybe not. It's kind of cozy in here, though. Like, minus all the rats and, like, I don't know, the rot that has been around. Isn't it kind of cozy? Like, wouldn't you kind of like to hang out here? We have freaking potatoes. Freaking potatoes. I'll hang out here. The spare bear welcoming. Thank you for joining us. Hey, hey, hello. Oh, finally, more healing. And a streetcar ticket. Lagenape. New Orleans Public Service Inc. Paul Waits. <gasps> Mr. Waits! Oh! The Crescent City. If we find the last piece here, we will get forbidden knowledge, it said behind me. Forbidden knowledge. I wonder what that would mean. Yeah, I guess what more what more could you need? Uh the light key. We, there was still another door that we could do stuff underneath it. It was a shiver or something underneath another door. Forbidden. Oh, are we gonna get electrocuted if we walk here? Which an electrical circuit breaker belonging to a fuse box. Ah, put that in here. Yeah, oi, oi, guess this works too. Does it? I don't know, I don't feel like it's very easy to see anymore. Not the dark, and we are alone in it. Valve handle. Oh, I forgot to click the wrong button. I forgot to click the wrong button. Can I? Can I turn the? the can I turn it back on, please? I, I cannot turn the lights back on. I have to be alone in the dark the entire time. Oh, no. I thought New Orleans was known as the big, the big. Why? Why is it easy? Crescent City. Oh, nickname for New Orleans, like the Big Apple. Hello. Anyone friendly in here? You're friendly, right? Right. Right? No, you're not. No, 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 no. He's calling him in me in the wall. Oh no. Oh no. I have axe. I have pickaxe. Pew. And then there's a shovel here. I'm gonna switch it out. I lose bullets so fast that it's probably better to just go for the melee.
the boiler steam going to be off now? No. Valve handle. Oh, we didn't even need to fix the puss in there? And my axe! I think we're through the tutorial, Shaggy. Jeremy? I think we find... What? Uncle, we found him? Hello? Uncle, why is he having barnacles? Ugh, how is that? Why is he? There was a dead body in here. Did I just imagine that? That is the first time you question anything and here? My axe. That's the first time she questions anything that she's just witnessed? Did I just imagine that? Was it eyeballs? Broken plates. Right, larger decorative plate. This is light and almost wood like quality. That, what do you mean wood like? Is that not wood? How is this not wood? Light and almost wood like quality. This is pottery? Is wood not wood like? I don't know. No, they would just say wood, no? Maybe? Just another day, just another day for Emily. I still don't know what happened. Trisha Gore, thank you for the 104 bits. Thank you. I still don't understand what just happened with the... Like, if we accidentally... Like, if he grew eyeballs or if he grew barnacles? Or whatever that might have been? Wouldn't you like to know? Thank you, Indiv. You'll be here all night, I presume. <laughs> Can we go back in here now? Still the key? Okay. I presume I have to the go... The body of DeSetto's clerk. Transformed into some eye-clad abomination Aye. before he suddenly disappeared. Surely it was all in her head. It was eyeballs. A horrible vision planted by the dark. But why were they like white around and then dark in the middle? They looked like barnacles. You wanna move fast? That's when it likes. Yes, we're bloodborne now. Yeah. Where was that place where it, there was something stuck under the door? Oh, it was upstairs, I think. Yeah. What shot? Not anymore. It worked. It worked. Brand new hallway. Really, everything is nice and pretty in here. Scary things. Thanks for the photos. Thank you so much. Eh? Who says? Ha 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 ha. Wow, this is a big room. Very Resident Evil. <gasps> Short cut. Yeah. Okay, awesome. Yeah. Now we can go from the other side into this hallway. Great, awesome. Oh. This is beautiful. Although was this supposed was there supposed to be a window here? Wow. This is quite the luxury. Yes. Can I break this? <gasps> I can. Oh. 
There was no loot inside though. I don't know, Winston, the bullets, they are kind of like costly. Rare. Red. Begnit. Lagnap. That, what can I say? I'm very good at languages. What's that sound? I have no idea. Uh, Big net and the rat poison. What a breakfast. Mmm, yummy. Yummy. Hi, Eso. What's up? A toast? Yes. Indeed, toast. Never let taking near your delicate pottery. <laughs> I'm just gently observing it with my shovel. I'm gently observing it. Beignet. Beignet? This looks not so great. No, I should have unlocked the other door. Heck, wait, let me out. It's like when cars are driving outside. Vroom. Observe with shovels. You don't. So now we're back here in this corridor. So now we unlocked that one. Good, 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 good. Maybe I should save just in case. <laughs> just in case. We don't want to accidentally go um, crashing and then lose a bunch of things. Upwards, downwards. Uh, up. A good idea. Maybe. Dad, I'm not the only one that heard cards driving. Yeah! Hello? Hello? It did sound like modern cars. Like traffic outdoors. Hello? Okay. Whoever is there is not there right now. You can't come to the phone. Wait, it says it's open. Look, it just says door. Am I maybe not able to interact with it in any way? Hmm. Maybe it's just really quick monsters <laughs> with the <laughs> The monsters are having a terrific yam outside. Meow. I need the key. Sitting room key. Oh shoot, didn't we find the sitting room? Beautiful. That was great. Good job. Oh, turn it to beautiful music. Do you teach piano as well? Huh? You're a governess. Did you teach those clawing Casano kids how to play the piano? Piano. How do you know about that? Just because grown-ups don't notice children doesn't mean we don't notice you. Yes. I taught them some piano. Are you any good at it? Not good enough to play a broken one. It fell from the attic, brought half the ceiling down. See that? It was Jeremy's fault, wasn't it? What? Are you blaming Nobody your- He knows what happened, but you're not wrong. Oop. Did I just blame my own uncle? Oh, it was him. It was Jeremy's fault. You know.
I'm gonna go now. See you around. What? Why is she doing that for? I'm gonna go now. <laughs> what on earth? Hearing it. What the heck? Did she just put it in our boot? Like, it, she stabbed us. I knew it was trouble, yeah. I thought, I, maybe I was naive. I really thought that she was a nice child. Well, at least we found all of these now. That's the one serving it that I said. Yeah, stabbed. The boot. It, this one is called a great depression. How do we, how do we see? Oh, show set bonus text. Ooh. As the world moved into the new decade, mm. America was spiraling into a maelstrom of debt, drought, and death. It was called the Great Depression and ruined many families. It was a fitting name, for poverty also breeds madness through desperation. Jeremy was, of course, no such victim, for he already Jeremy. witnessed the darkness within. He knew the shadow that stood on his threshold very well. It wasn't new. It was something that had always been with him. He even says, Yeah, me. What's up, Neil? Thanks for coming in. Hello. <laughs> Dig up, you're being kept busy today. <laughs> Maybe I can make them permanent because it doesn't feel like something that is worry worrisome. I can make them permanent later. <laughs> Just like note them down, maybe, if you don't mind uh, noting them down and I can add them permanent. <laughs> okay, hmm. All right, so it's like little, little info hints, little infos. Hmm. Oh look, it's a pira. Wait, were these invented back then in the days? Bloop. Well, oh, permanent bands? No. Permanent auto mod uh, phrases. People keep keep getting stuck in auto mod. We're saying the word boot. Imagine boots bot being here. That would never have worked. Every single boots bot. <laughs> No, it's it's allowed now. So now you can say it without getting in trouble. Now you can say it without it uh, getting caught. Wait, where are we? I wish the marker was like facing a direction. Okay, there's something here. Medicine books key. Could that be in Lottie's room? Steal something here. Oh, here. No. Is that it? That was it. We did. There wasn't even anything in it. We just got something. Just got something, nothing, something, nothing. Uh, Yoni, welcome in. Hello and welcome. Time to add butters to the band word list. <laughs> Imagine, butters is getting banned every time he speaks or caught in auto mode. Hmm. Hmm. Um. New Orleans is called the Crescent City because of the shape of the Mississippi River that runs past it. Oh, which above looks like a crescent. Yo, I didn't know. That's so cool. Thanks for the fun fact, Ackerman. <gasps> Seems like a very nice community to set the list. Well, I know, they are so kind. When they're not uh, trying to get banned with auto mod, I guess. Butters is a little troll. But other than that... um. Chat is pretty dang friendly. Thanks for joining it, Neil. Thanks for coming in. I hope you're doing well. Thanks for joining us tonight for some... Uh, alone in the dark. 
Well, yeah, that's true. You, everyone else who tags you will get banned. Wait, I was trying to heat the dining room. Is that there? I was actually born and raised in New Orleans. Really? There is more of that unsettling rot. What rot? Oh, there. <laughs> what rot? Okay, fine. I guess we found the rot. On the commonplace of evil. Clue. On the commonplace of evil. There lies virtue and stark irreverence. Careless thoughts of luminous indifference. But blame not the beast we once were, which science so often wished to refer. Not the wicked full of sin. The poem. It is you who stand and grin. All our good intentions aside, whereupon we build our pride. Sunless solitude, follow not this corrupting light. Prophets of confidence, Always crashes out of sight. Hear me. For we all bear this mark. Thus we must remain alone in the dark. Title drop! She said the thing! She said it! Also, it doesn't say in that text on the right, but it said here that it was Nora Keith. She said it! It said that this was from Nora Keith. And that is... Remember, that's somebody from the original artistry... Um, what are they called? The ones that were here and that disappeared in the middle of a hurricane? Those ones. The typo. There is. Um, it says, alone in the dark. Oh yeah, alone in the dark. This is alone in the dark in this one. Uh, <laughs> didn't realize. I was just listening without following along with the text. Cool. Uh, Nora Keith wrote this. One of the people who lived here before, before they disappeared in the hurricane. Who Elisabetta was part of their group. And we still don't really know what that's all about. What do they mean a hurricane came and disappeared everyone? Or made everyone vanish. Okay, now that door is unlocked. What do we have now? The Shoot. What did they say? The prick of the syringe hadn't hurt as much as the human. I forgot to go stabbed by the syringe. What was in that? that child. Emily just couldn't make any sense of her behavior. Grace seemed amused, but not mocking. Was this just her being playful? As her feelings subsided, playful. a second thought appeared. She wouldn't have injected her with something, would she? What, what do you mean she wouldn't inject you? She stabbed us with a syringe, and we are thinking there was probably nothing in it. Why else would somebody stab you with a syringe? There's definitely something injected. We have something in it. Maybe we have the rot. Don't know. Hmm. Okay, time to go to Lottie's room and see if this medicine key was to her... That was the wrong room. The medicine key was to her little box, maybe? Yes! Dr. Jenkins Losenges. These words are Greek to me, and I'm not Greek. I was injected by suspicion. A oh, with suspicion. Mm, yes, yeah, something sus. It's Dr. Lero Jenkins. Lo Dr. L Jenkins Los Angeles. Dr. <laughs> Dr. Jenkins Los Angeles. The item. Vital vitamins. One of several medicines prescribed to the author Cassandra Beauregard. That's the person who was staying here at the writer's block. 
This particular bottle contains tablets sent to relieve sore throats and contain two vital vitamins. <gasps> two vitamins? I wonder what they were. Vitamin A and B, I guess. <laughs> we'll do something with the window now. Nurses watch like in Yappe. Ooh, okay. How okay? With the kid is an amateur gen geneticist and wants blood for her evil cloning plans. <laughs> you think she's gonna make an army of Emily's as a clone? Uh, I mean, as a clone, clone army. I'm just sitting here waiting. Oh, looking for references to Alan Wick. <laughs> I mean, I feel like we found a little bit. Okay, we don't have a the top puzzle there is for um the lens, so we cannot do that. Um what is the one with the clerk's office? That puzzle piece is for a safe, right? Um and then they are bolted doors, bolted locked. Do we have the key to that? What did we have keys for? Can I can I see what I have down here? Sitting room key. Um sitting room. Oh yeah, we never went downstairs, did we? Oh, it's upstairs the sitting room. But weren't we able to go downstairs to the Basement? Somehow? Maybe not. Lusenges is pronounced Lausinians. Lausinians? Hey, do you want to eat some Lausinians? Okay. Lausinians. The sitting room has not been explored from my observations. I don't think so, no. Is the sitting room the one we sit inside? Ah, ah. Wait, that would be my room right now. I'm sitting. I have a bag of sherry losenges. Wait, what is a losenge? Oh, this is the right floor. Like a cough drop. Oh. You sing it. Strap seals. All right. Oh, sitting room is here. Sitting room. Wait, the medicine is a key item, by the way. Come on, Grace. I'm too tired for games. Oh, okay. Even let's play with my jackknife. Oh, good evening. What's this guy? You haven't seen a little girl. The one who doesn't have a. I don't think so. Uh, you would have known if you did. The only kid crazy enough to be in this place. She's not in her room then? <laughs> that would be a first. Always running around causing trouble. She's very hard to pin down, that one. You want a sip? I'm good, thank you. You want a sip? I should be going then. <clears throat> Unless there's anything you need from me. I just want to find my uncle before hey, we're good. Happens. Thanks. Please. Bye. Oh, don't worry, miss. He'll show up. <laughs> he is much too lily livered to kill himself. Why would he? <laughs> it's his greatest night, ambition, Matty. didn't you know? Take care now. That was the guy who... Uh, <laughs> that dude has a no risk. <laughs> SMHing. Oh, we've got notes. Every time it says McCarthy notes... It off to that's why. ...to continue his search for the little girl. Emily had meant to ask why he was looking for her, but decided against it, fearing that it would just prolong an already awkward scene. 
Could we not have said, yeah, she just stabbed us with this dying ring? Could we not have said that? He shouldn't go looking for her. Because she is danger ropes. Or maybe he's the one who set her... <gasps> he's the one who set her up for it, maybe. And was like, yo, can you go do this? And now he's like, did you do it? He wants to find her. See if she did it. Hmm. That is running. Why so? Someone's about to take a bath? Also use things are building here. I keep getting confused to where we're at. Cassandra's room, Grace room. Did he try to go in there? There's something missing. Locked globe. Oh no! France is missing! German Empire. This map is looking a little bit different. Locked globe. If we plop in maybe some... Uh, a piece there. We will learn geography! This code must have stolen France. I can't believe it. <sighs> France is missing, Ted. Taking my head. Okay. We'll, we'll, go, we'll go find it somewhere. And go in here. Uh, I'm sure... <laughs> I'm sure Grace is a normal kid with the regular stuff going on in here, right? Nothing creepy or anything whatsoever. So this is Grace's room. Cute. School sixes. It is kind of cute. It's actually surprisingly normal for somebody who just stabbed us in in our behind with a syringe. Okay. Oh, yeah, in the box like Niape. Okay. Oh, Rushash. When it makes you worse. Small request. <gasps> what is this? Don't you worry, Grace. Go play your game, bleat and bellow with the others. I won't be jealous. There will be more masquerades. However, I would love it if you would finish my mask for the feast. With love, Ruth. Ruth! Uh, Ruth is the one we met yesterday that we wondered, are we familiar or why is she so flirty with us? Like, do we have a past? Do we have history? But I don't know if... Um, I don't... It feels like they were saying, like, nice to meet you. But it was like... This, the, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, Ruth was, uh, yeah, exactly. Ruth, Ruth was uh, flirting with us yesterday. Um, I don't know who she's drawing. Is that Hopper? Hmm. Amazing stories! A ship on top of the pyramids? Hmm. Flirting. Yeah, she was flirting. There's something in the sitting room I didn't pick up. What is that? Oh, it's the key globe thing. Right. Hello, Cassandra, are you home? Oh no, it auto saved the chat. It auto saved in Cassandra's room. This must be the great Cassandra Beauregard's room. Beauregard. I'm not sure what I expected. Maybe something more extravagant? I think she's the one who bought the house, wasn't she? I think oh, I've seen this somewhere. Yeah, I think I've seen this somewhere too. 
the combination with the what are they called zodiac signs we know how to sort those out now uh yuhusa oh did i not say hi before uh oh <laughs> told you that sounds interesting margrave liniment hmm one of several medicines prescribed to the author Cassandra Beauregard. This particular bottle contains an ointment for pain relief sold at the fourth, as the fourth version of the company's popular recipe. Four. Is that what they're trying to say? Zodiac. Miss Beauregard, I picked up your medicine at the post office today. As you understand, it needs to be administered by the orderlies for your safety. I have put the box in Lottie's room for now and... I'm sure she will find you as soon as possible. Mr. Waits. Mr. Waits. Is he the one that turned out to have all the eyeballs? Because when we saw him, it feels like we said like, oh, What's Uncle that? Jeremy. Medicine train. <gasps> oh, my gravel liniment, Dr. Jensen is saying yes. These Woo! all have it's a raid, it's a party. party. Woo! Woo! party. <laughs> oh my gosh, is this an incoming raid from Zora? Welcome, mm, hi, builders. Wow, we there's so many of you. Thanks so much for joining, everyone. Hello, exit. Welcome, in Kilabra. Hello, welcome. I love this emote. Thanks for joining. Thanks so much for joining. Bubble, what's up? Hello, Rick. Hello. Welcome in, Nikki. Thank you so much. Zero stick. Good to see you. Thank you for coming in. Thank you, everybody, so much for joining. Come on, Herder. Hello, Wraith. Hello. Delicious. Hello. Welcome. Thanks so much, everybody, for joining. Thank you for joining. Hi, everyone. Welcome. Sorry, how was your stream? How was Dragon's Dogma 2? Are you enjoying it? I hear a lot of people are having a hecking great time with that game right now. Hi everybody, also welcome. Hi. Whoa, scary game. Did you play this game? This game is so good. Hi, builders. Hello. If we haven't met before, it is nice to meet you. Hello, you can call me Hecky. I'm from Sweden. Uh, we are a variety channel playing uh, lots of different kinds of games. Today we're playing a game called Alone in the Dark. It came out earlier this week. It's a remake of an original game came coming out or that came out back in the 90s. Kind of set the set the set the horror survival on the map, uh, or it started it even. Um, really good, uh, really good uh, um, game so far. I'm enjoying this a lot. We're exploring, we're investigating. It's puzzly. It's got all of them elements that you know from like Resident Evil, um, and uh, and a little even more investigative things. As you can see, I have a lot of documents in here and um i like it i like it a lot this is so cool um i haven't played alone in the dark i'm excited to see some gameplay I'm hoping i can stay up for a little bit but might crash very fair it is lit and also um after streams especially you can feel a bit um like you need some rest and recuperation so understandable please feel free to lurk or if you you know need to run away and grab something to eat or something uh Thank you so much, Sara, for thinking about us and for wanting to send over your world here. Thank you so much. That's very kind of you. Chat, if you are not following Sara already, go like, comment, subscribe on the link in chat. Somewhere popping up, right? Somewhere, somewhere, right? Uh, there! It's right there in chat! If you missed it earlier. Uh, if you want to see some Dragon's Dogma, do. Uh, or if you maybe in the future... Want to see some more Alone in the Dark? I hope you pick it up. I hope you will enjoy Yay. it. Um, but I, I feel like Dragon's Dogma is quite, quite is, is a bit long, maybe? It's going to take a while for people to get through, maybe? You played that climbing game last time when we read that it looks super frustrating. <laughs> you know, sometimes it's just... Um, sometimes a frustrating time is just... Yay! Yay! Yay. <laughs> no gonna get some challenges in life etc um it was still a lot of fun it was still a lot of fun i did have fun um but it was slightly frustrating uh commandant herder also thank you so much for gifting a soup to sora thank you sora 
Welcome back. Enjoy emotes. Thank you for coming by. Um, thank you so much, Herder. That's very kind of you. Thank you. Also, Haxer, thank you for gifting five subs into the chat. Thank you very much. I hope the people who got gifted are gonna be enjoying their emotes and popcorns as well. Um, you got Rual. Wow, cool. Uh, awesome. Awesome. Uh, thank you so much, Haxer. That's very kind. Out of nowhere. Thank you so much. Dicky, hello. Welcome. Thanks for joining. Thank you, readers. Anybody who came in with a read from Sora, thank you so much for taking the time to say hi and come by here. Thank you very, very much. Thank you for the follows also. Thank you so much. Um, If you are all heading out, maybe you're like, oh, I also got it. Uh, have a wonderful rest of your time zone. Take care of yourself. If you want to stick around, feel free to grab a seat. We are uh, going through this game. As I said, it is a uh, Horror survival, so it's a bit poopy, but also it's got a lot of puzzle elements. If you're familiar with like Resident Evil style, uh, this is what originally inspired, like the OG game of this inspired Resident Evil. So I've heard at least, and um, that seems to ring very true considering what we are doing in this game. Um, so I think this is really, really neat. We're playing as this character, you might recognize her, Yori Kom... Kom... Cumber? Yori? Yeah. Yori. That one. Famous actress that I actually haven't seen anything. I haven't seen anything starring her. But I know she's great. A very beloved um, actress. And uh, there is also David Harbour in this game as well. Uh, Hopper from Stranger Things. Or also... Um, what is that other thing I saw with him? I forgot. But he's also... Um, yeah, Villanelle. A lot of people know her as that, I think. Villanelle. I don't know how to pronounce that. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. But I know I know a lot of people are liking. No, not that Yodi, but sure. Um, close enough. <laughs> and um, uh, yeah, so it's super cool. A uh, concept of having two different characters in the game. You can play. Uh, you can choose who to play as. Uh, and they have slightly different also experiences, different games. We are not really hanging out with David Harbour right now, so. Um, uh, we're off on our own, alone, in the dark, or currently in the light, I guess, where there is kind of... Honestly, this is kind of a cozy place. Uh, we're looking for our uncle. That's basically the gist of it all. We're looking for our uncles and clues about where he might have gone. We are in Louisiana in the 1930s, and um, there is a lot of mysterious things that keep on happening. We seem to be traveling through space and time. There is uh, strange uh, things uh, going on. We're on our way to try to find our uncle. Basically, that's it. And our uncle is gone. Uh, happy lurking, Sora. Have a good food. Uh, bon appetit. Thank you so much for thinking about us. Thank you for wanting to bring your red over. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bon appetit. Sleepy, sleepy time. T time to stay hydrated. Heck yeah, Calamara. Heck yeah. Oh, she was in Free Guy? I haven't seen that either. Blah, 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 blah. Thank you, Digger, for the shout out. Yeah, link in chat. Uh, bye, so everybody say bye bye. Ooh. Yes. Oh, the game is smooth. Okay, yeah. I'm having some stutters in the game. I'm having a bit of a performance uh, issue here with the, with the game. I am playing on PC and some other. There is a lot of Steam reviews that are reporting similar things. So I think it's just um, it needs some maybe tweaking and, and or patching. But uh, if you are thinking of picking it up uh, right now, the, the console version seems very stable. It's cool. I sent the game a few streams and it was always the guy protagonist. Can you choose which one to play or is it a chapter thing? No, you get to choose and then you play as that character the whole playthrough. But I think you can uh, like replay the game with a different character and you will get like a different experience since they are not they're not going around exploring together, right? They're they're on their own. That's very interesting that you're saying that most people are playing as the Mr. Barnaby. Barnaby. I didn't know. Um, I feel like this. It felt like it, it felt like it made sense to start with her, since she is her family story. But or maybe you just accidentally happened to catch them when they had already finished her story. Hmm. It has some minor optimization issues on PC when the game loads to something major. There's a slight stutter. Yeah, exactly. But I think it's gonna be. Uh, um, 
It's, it's probably the medicine gonna... bottles had stains of rot Divine. on the labels, suggesting some greater shape. They just needed to be put in the right order. Oh, I didn't mean but to get that hint, us? but this is exactly what I was going to say. Um, right now, our objective is to... We're trying to make our way around everywhere, figuring out puzzles. We just got to this room and we found this little um, medicine tray here with the bottles on it. And I presumed that they were going to be put in a certain or order. And I wanted to check because this one... Remember this one? I said, wow, two vitamins? There's probably two. And this one has four. So there's a two and a four. Lintment. We probably put the losenges in the... Can I change position? Oh, okay. Two. Can I see the bottom mark? Four. Did they see two vitamins? Oh, that's the one. Number one. Wait, why is this so hard? You do it? <gasps> that was not it? Oh, we need to make the little thingies. Seven. Okay, we need to make a little snake out of the root. Okay. Uh, no, let me remember my chance to ask for information. Wow, use. Yeah, that's great. Um, it's great. That's important to know as well. Very important when you are, you know, out and about or in another country. Definitely a good thing to know. Good job. Fun off. Oh, we are not allowed to have fun anymore, Butters, because you're going to bed. I see. Well, Butters, have fun. Happy sleeping. Don't dream any nightmares about, um, uh, I don't know, Losenges. What? Yimri turned it back on again! Let's go chat! It's party time! We literally, Yimri said so! Okay. <laughs> also, this said... This said that we did it. What does that mean? Two, five, seven... Two... Five... Oh, oh, we only need three. Two, five, seven. And then we check with our horoscope, I almost said, with our zodiac signs. We need two, which is Piskis. Piskis? Light! Thank you so much for the 101 beats. Thanks for getting a ticket. Oh, the fun fee, because the fun has been uh, activated by Yimri. You are now allowed to have fun. Enjoy lights. Enjoy the fun. Peace keys. It's the... It's that one. The number two there. Next to Aquarius. Peace keys. One, two, three, four, five. Is Yemeni. I'm having to draw them so that I know because I wouldn't remember otherwise. Five, six, seven. Leo. That's the one that looks like a little earring. Okay. Yemeni Cricket. Yeah, that one. Look how beautiful. Isn't it beautiful? Look at my piskies. Look. My piskies. <laughs> Not piskies! <laughs> piskies! <gasps> And the lion, yeah, the Swedish lion. <laughs> okay, here we go. Kiss, kiss. Uh, I forgot already what this was. Oh, Yemeni. Yemeni. 
And Leo. Yay! Wait, a whole shrine was down here. <gasps> we found the last plate! Yay! We did it! And Parsh, Parsh, Holland, and our family emblem has a lion. <gasps> Is it the Swedish lion? Does it look like the one in chat? No, that's the Swedish, not the not a Netherlandic and Hollandic lion. That that's the Swedish lion, isn't it terrifying? Absolutely ruthless. Watch out for that one. The Swedish lion. <laughs> The holistic lion, yeah. It has a light and almost wood-like quality. Once again, chat, an almost wood-like quality, but apparently not wood. Whatever this might be, it is not wood. I like Swedish lion more. It is uh, quite unique. It is uh, quite a unique one. I worry that is you. But think it's bone. You mean they just grinded bones down? Is it part of the Swedish Zodiac? <laughs> you know, I wish. There is no Swedish Zodiac as far as I am Heist. concerned. Choo -choo. Choo. The Swedish Lion in the Swedish Zodiac. Um, sitting room has the... Globe. Jeremy's room has that one... Uh, drawer or something we need a key for. Uh, have we gotten into the other, to the empty room, Ruth and McCarfrey? I don't think so. I need to go back to the food and wine cellar as well. It looks like there was a lot of stuff we missed there. And the stairwell! We never went downstairs into the infirmary! Okay, now I need to go there. Because this is weird. I don't know why we never went there. Let's go out and into the mezzanine. Mezzanine. Yeah, we gotta go to the wine cellar. <laughs> What's up, Super Magnasty? Welcome in. Well, thanks for reminding me to drink. A Swedish zodiac of a poorly taxidermied animals. Oh, of poorly taxidermied animals would be pretty cool. I do agree. I do agree. Um, I don't even know. I would be a then the goat. The some some badly taxidermied goat. This lit outdoors. Don't even have a balcony. I thought the drip came from the game during stuttering. <laughs> Bloop. <laughs> that was down here. We never went. Maybe it was blocked. But is that the kind of goat? Oh, wait, wrong way. I need the key. Trish Gord, thank you for the 666 beats. Thank you for burning the goat. Maybe that would be my goat after all. Also, I misunderstood. I thought this is how we get downstairs. Never mind, it's not. Wait. Oh, the arrow is to where it goes up. Shoot. Okay, I misunderstood. So I can't go down there then. But we can go to the food and wine cellar still. Um, so let's go back there from here. Is this game is too scary for you? Well, freedom. You know what's great when you think a game is too scary? You let somebody else play it for you. That's what Twitch is for. Watching others go through the games that you don't want to go through yourself. Watch others uh, poop their pants while you sit uh, comfortably unscared. Well, I might scream a little bit in your ears, to be fair, so warning and viewer discretion is advised. 
How do I get there? Do I get down the stairs? I do go down the stairs. That's what I'm for. Yeah, I'm here for. <laughs> You're welcome, chat. Uh oh. Yeah, every time we load like a new area, we stutter. You see that? That's the kind of stutteries that we get. Like now, it's fine. But when we get to new areas, this one is not fine. Okay, apparently we missed something in down in here in the wine. Down in here in the wine. Becky, she'll poop your pants for you. Wait, your pants? I'm not sure about that. Just the jävla goat. Wait. The doll on a horse. The uh, blue eye. A blue scope. Yeah, you s look at you. You know, you know so many Swedish little things. You're basically Swede now. Basically a Swede. Am I? Oh, there's something here. For second crucifix? Good. Yeah, can we grab some good 19, 1986 wine? Calambra, this is taking place in 1930. So I don't think they have got any 1986 wine. But uh, maybe 1886, perhaps? Jordan, I will try not to poop your pants. <laughs> I will try not to. Uh, yeah, Ehrlich, you're welcome. Now you know where to look for it. Uh, a thousand young. Okay, oh, now we just need a trumpet. <laughs> you think we can find a trumpet just laying around somewhere? If anyone's gonna poop my, my pants, it's gonna be me. <laughs> Radioactive, I will leave you to it. Uh, Indigo, thank you for hanging out. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful sleep. Take care of yourself. We'll see you maybe next week. Or in the VOD. Uh, this, will, this VOD, this stream will go up on YouTube. Hopefully, um, tomorrow. Okay. This one is now looted. Great. Uh, garage, kitchen, garden is still having something. Boiler room still has the puzzle piece. Okay. Next up, repair the day. Oh yeah, we are where we needed to go. I didn't even realize we went where we needed to go. I just checked the wine age. It's between 1920 and 1930. Is that where the age of these wines are? Yeah, grab grab a handful, Calambra. There is plenty. There's also some delicious yellow... Peach! Hmm? And canned salmon? You feeling uh, peckish? In the mood for some canned salmon? Maybe lemon? Oranges. Uh... Yeah, that's about it. That's all we got. Canned uh, salmon and just a bunch of uh, citrus fruits. <laughs> um, anything fancy is your tickle? I mean, tickle is your fantasy. <laughs> anything tickle is your fancy? Mm? Peach, please. Uh, can't go in there again. Now I think of the old Swedish comedy song about canned porridge. We have an old Swedish song about ca canned porridge? Beautiful! Okay. Now here comes the sun. Do -do -do -do. I think these are actually waves in the bottom. Do, 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 do. Um, it's all right. 
Okay, let, let's put the middle pieces in first. That is probably actually he... He... There. No. There. There! That's there! Okay. Look at us go, chat. And there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And then... This piece. I'm a pussy professional, chat. Don't you even worry. I've done this a billion times at least. Uh, a billion times at least. Do 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 do. Hey, we did it! Much easier than the talisman puzzles. Yay! What watches will free to skip 30 minutes? What? What do you mean 30 minutes? I'm profesh! Okay, and now as of yesterday's ending of the stream, I finally know how to do these things. Okay? So now, number five, number seven, number nine. And that's from big to small. Nay, nice, small to big. So big is gonna be nine. Nine. Seven. So we learned that we need these little... The arrows need to point at the number. So the bottom... In the very bottom middle, there's an arrow. And we make that one point to nine. Because that was the biggest of the round things. And then the arrow of the outer ring now points inwards here and we're trying to make that point at seven right there's a seven there and then the arrow from this one oh oops the arrow from that one needs to point at five and look how fast this took me 40 minutes that took me 40 minutes to figure out last night 40 minutes i looked at the vod Actually, it took more than that because we spent 40 minutes on the time I, I figured out the puzzle. But then it took like an additional 30 minutes uh, when I when I used it beforehand as well. Sure felt longer. Yeah, 40 minutes according, according to the VOD. But not today. Does that mean I sold this room now? I did. Okay, great. This is weird. Aren't we supposed to be in that little room next to the boiler room? Why is our character standing in the other room? This is so dark and scary. I think the map is wrong here. It says it. I'm in the kitchen. The arrow at the bottom needs to be more obvious. I think so too, Yuvial. I honestly think so too. I spent so long because I thought that the, the the I thought the arrow was the top thing. The top of the thing. The top thing, the top of the thing. Okay, uh, it showed us something. It showed us in here. Oh. Okay, it has changed. Is this a cult meeting? Chat, did you bring your robes? Look for Jeremy for inside the chapel. I'm in another one of Jeremy's dreams. You don't really want to go here, though. On this here lies. Rosie. No. Rose? Buried. Those buried. Okay, doesn't say anybody's name. I thought maybe it would be a person we found before. No, why am I finding bullets? That means we're gonna fight an enemy. Got your hoodie? Uh, good enough, Kelambra. Of course the map was wrong. Yeah? I wasn't in the kitchen. 
I was in the room to the right of the boiler. You know what? Saving is a good call. Woo! Woo! Yay! It's a raid! It's a party! Oh, woo! Woo! What on earth? Excuse me? Is this DVT? The one and only? Oh my gosh, what are we getting spoiled tonight by the Swids? Wow, the Swids are coming over. Hi, Nannerpunk, welcome in. Linnade, hello. Alice Allspice, Skadison, hello. Lord, welcome in. Uh, Provolone, welcome. Z, hello. Doctor, Doctor, by the way, hello. You yeah, see you there also. Rent a cat, can you do that? I'm allergic. I would like to see if I was uh, not allergic to some specific species of cat. Hmm, that could be actually a good idea. Wow, it's a raid! DVT, thank you so much for reading. What the heck? Hi! <laughs> Thanks for coming by. I appreciate it. Um, welcome. What do you mean you have a heavy accent? This <laughs> what did what did DVT say? Welcoming Raiders. Hi! Well, there's so many of you. Thank you so much for joining. Hello, if we haven't met before. <clears throat> Hello, you can call me Heki. I'm from Sweden. Like DVT. Thanks for coming over. Uh, we play all kinds of games in here. Today we're playing a little game called Alone in the Dark. It's, um, we are alone in the dark. Um, have you played this? Divita plays really good games. Uh, I think she plays a lot of really, like, a lot of titles that I enjoy a lot as well. So maybe you would like it, but I don't know if you're into puzzle. Like, this is like early Resident Evil puzzling kind of stuff. Maybe? They think I have a heavy accent, so I sent them here so they can compare. <laughs> also, you can cl clear your name a little bit. Thanks for the four rolls. Welcome in. Chat, if you're here and you're not following DVD, please do yourself a favor. Follow, like, comment, subscribe. She's great. I like to lurk in there. She's really cool. Um, I'm hoping we can hang out sometime. I think, uh, we <laughs> I think, <laughs> I think that would be kind of cool. Um, do like, comment, subscribe, comment, subscribe, subscribe. Also, it's very nice. That there's another Swedish person <laughs> who has a DJ sleep schedule. Because, like, David is one of the few Swedish streamers that are, like, live uh, lit. Like, lit. Like, lit. Um, I would say this is, like, an early end for her. <laughs> Maybe? I don't want to call you out. But I, I, I'm just, like, feeling happy. I'm just... I'm feeling um, some, some... I'm not feeling so alone, thanks to you. <laughs> So I'm really happy. I think you are the only ones that is later than me sometimes. <laughs> We're here uh, representing Sweden on the internet in the night times. We can uh, we can host the the night owls, the nocturnal Swedes in here. A very early ending for Div. Yeah, see, Erlish, you know too. Yeah, chat, if you are not following DVT already, you should do so. <laughs> She's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Slay Swede did an hour. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> this game is great. I, I think it's great, at least. I'm really enjoying it. Um, I'm having a lot of fun. It's, um, it's definitely something that I feel like... Um, you, can, you can tell that it's got... Um, I don't want to spoil anything, but you can definitely tell that people have told me that this game is like the origin of this game that came out in the 90s is what inspired Resident Evil. And I really can feel it. I played Resident Evil 1 like a year ago. I was a little late to that party, but I played a lot of Resident Evil throughout the years. And it really feels like those early kind of you go around, you puzzle a lot of things, you try to like sort things out. I think it may be a little easier also because they've made it... Um, They've made it so that you can choose in the start of the game. You can choose difficulty, but you can also choose like how much hints you want. If you're not super into puzzles and you still want to play the game, I think that's made that like, you know, the remakes. Uh, the remake might be a little more accessible, easier um, to to kind of uh, change your your gameplay a little bit, um, like your experience. Uh oh, Calambra! Oh no! <laughs> I'm so sorry! Did you accidentally put a dot or was that a link for real? I'm so sorry. Um, I love Resident Evil, but I never played the originals, just remix. Right. Except Resident Evil 4. Okay. Well, if you enjoy Resident Evil, 
and you don't mind like the element of puzzling that is inside of the Resident Evil games as well. Um, I would say I recommend this to you. Uh, I think it's I'm having a lot of fun with it, and it's cool because it's like you recognize the faces. You're like, wow, look, it's Jody, or wow, it's David Harbour, the other guy uh, from Stranger Things. My bad on that link sent the wrong. No, 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 don't worry, Calambra. Uh, in nothing personal. The bot was just like, ah, a link must be something fishy. It only does that if you have hung out in the stream for less than an hour. So otherwise you should be fine sending links. Hi, Wolf. Good morning. Anyway, if you need to like go take care of yourself post stream, please do. Please take care. Um, Go well, good, eat and uh, sleep, maybe? Early bedtime. Perhaps? Um, thank you for thinking about us. Thank you for coming in. Thank you. We have been so spoiled with the wonderful people coming in reading tonight. I am um, flattered. Yeah, link in chat. Thank you, Digup. Thank you for the shout out. Link in chat if you want to go follow another Swed um, chat. And and uh, thanks for coming by. Thank you. If anybody is reading and you're also heading out, thanks for coming by to say hi with the DVT Red. Um, if you want to hang out, grab us it. Feel free to join us. We are uh, heading into spoopy territory. I think we should be ready with our weapon because we found ammo. And we're in a graveyard, so I mean that kind of tells you that we're about to feel something maybe perhaps. Um yeah. Yeah, happy lurking also. Don't get like spoiled if you wanna play it also. But I think you should play it. I think you will have a good time. I'm having a little bit of performance issues on PC right now. But uh, it's still it's fine. It's definitely still playable. Save? I didn't I save? I saved right before the raid game. Yeah, look. Six, seven minutes ago. I, I'm trying to not say it too many times. I always make a new save. I'm gonna have to start overwriting myself soon. Is strong demanding game on graphics? I think maybe so. I think it might just need some optimization. It runs well on, on console though. Yeah, early bedtime. I'm trying to get better schedules since I've started working out and stuff, but still a working process. Any step in the right direction is a step in the right direction, Div. You're doing great. Um, proud of you. I'll, I'll, I'll join you at some point uh, in getting better. Yeah. Um, anyway, good luck. Did I go in a circle? No. I'm slightly worried that there's going to be something jumping out. So I'm just trying to be a little... I'm sorry in advance. I might get a scream. Is this a chapel? Or is this just a tomb? Oh wait, that's a chapel, right? They say go to the chapel. I don't want to accidentally go to the right way without exploring. Is this our uncle's grave? It's been a while since I visited the family tomb. Oh. I hope it's in a better state than the real world. Algernon Lyle Hartwood, industrialist and diviner. Born 1828. Died 1900. At Multisaepevera. Oh, it's Latin. <laughs> I thought it meant like he died at Multisaepevera. Vatiga. Vat. Tikinati Ui Cassandra hmm? Chat, did you know I spoke Latin? I do Was that him? Family grave, but there is just one person here Can we open it? It's Latin to me Latin, Swedish, same thing. M1, thank you so much. Wow, we 56. Wait a minute, 56 is on your badge. I believe your popcorn has changed its color. It color. Thank you so much for the 56 months of being subbing. Thank you. I think that's four and a half years. Oh my gosh, did I do maths correct? On a day where I slept three hours? <laughs> it is a Christmas miracle. Thank you so much, M1. Thank you for 56 months of being so big. Oh, I did not, though. <laughs> Hi, 
I was so proud for a second. Oh, never mind. It's not a new badge. Scrap everything I just said. M1. False alarm. Uh, don't even worry about it. Okay. Chapel. Can I go here first? Yes. Medallion. The blessing. Hmm. A rustic plate adorned with the lost allegory. Is this a, a star sign in the back? No, that's like a cross. Yes. Yeah, what is this? Can I put it here? What's that for? Uh. There we go. There we go. I was that easy. Can I take the map? I cannot. Your map is of no use here. It is so brutal. Oh, this was a dead end. Okay. I don't know. Eh? Oh, secrets. Nice. That hand gesture is a blessing. What oh, is? You sneak. Do I have to kill it? Ah, ah, wait, second, wait, I am leaving. Goodbye. Are you coming after? Have I found a single shotgun ammo, by the way? I should probably not. Wait, 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 wait. I'm reloading. This is not nice. Haven't you heard of being nice? Waiting when people are reloading? potato I'm wasting so many bullets I only have a couple left <laughs> I'm playing with a controller I'm playing on PC but I'm playing with a controller for those of you who are wondering why my aim is so all over the place I promise I aim better on a computer with I mean with keyboard and mouse <laughs> L5 what's up Thanks for joining! Was I here before? The days are melting. Uh, I have not seen you before, but I might have missed you. Uh, never mind, Digup says you're, that's your first message today. You were here yesterday, L5. Thanks for coming by again. Also, did we just find a sledgehammer? Just tell me this have a little more durability than the pipes. Hey! Oh, oh, it's one of them with like extra legs growing on top of it. Uh, what? Does it have two heads? Did it have two heads? Oh, the sledgehammer did do a lot of damage. I am curious. It's hammer time! We're doing quite a lot of damage, actually. Oh, oh. laggy. Do we drop the same thing in here? This is the chapel in Jeremy's book. It looks like I need more medallions to open it. More medallions. I'm okay. not sure I have everything I need. I don't think I have everything I need. <laughs> Okay, I guess we're just gonna go and see if we can find more medallions. That's not open yet. Uh, I don't, I don't know why some of the enemies have two heads. I presume we're gonna figure it out at some point, or we're gonna get answers to it. But I'm slightly confused. Then again, there's like quite a... To be fair, all of the things look like they've been kind of through Fallout. All of the enemies. Does anyone else get compulsion to listen to songs from specific words? I want to listen to Sledgehammer by Peter Gabriel now. Ah. Uh... Oh my gosh. It's so crowded over there. 
Uh, I don't know. Birkeborg. I can definitely get them stuck in my brain, but I'm not sure if I would necessarily need to listen to them. Oh no, there is water. I need to go into the swamp. Hey, there was somebody in the swamp. There is occupied. Okay, I'm going the other way. There is a person there. No, I'm going upstairs. Why are you following? I am stuck. I'm stuck. I can't dodge in water. Oh my gosh. I am so screwed. Hang on. Kindly explode your face. I need to reload. Hello. May I ask for exploding face? Ah! What's going on? I need to spam a boost on. That's the first time we've ever done that. Excuse. Excuse. Okay. I'm just gonna swap weapon instead of reloading. Can you... Kindly, do I need to sledgehammer? <laughs> I did need a sledgehammer. Oh gosh, okay. I have very little bullets. Why did I just get eaten? We have still not died, by the way. Not a single time. And I don't know what happens if we die. Probably just restart from the checkpoint, but... That one just grabbed us. Uh, does he have his inside as well on his outside? Why are they so yelly? Do you see that? They look like... What is pulsating? That not is... That is not insides, is it? Maybe it's just eagles. Yeah, I, they broke the hammer. Somehow. I broke an entire sledgehammer by hitting on a skeleton. This goes tang. Eagles on the inside. I'm in the Swedish eagle. Uh, a, uh, anyone feeling a bit thirsty? We got some, uh, a water break. Uh, uh, no, no, eagle. <laughs> eagle. Squall to you. Tanky tankies. A dragon. Hi, thanks for being here. I. I think we need to be strategic, strategic, because when we are walking in water, like I press dodge now, I can't dodge, which is a good lesson. Now we know we can't fight in water. I can't run. I can't sneak. <laughs> the game quite literally wants us to sneak. Can I save here? Oh my gosh, yes. I mean, I don't want to really do that. Clear. <laughs> oh, that one. Chat, we're being very sneaky right now. <gasps> Another sledgehammer. Uh, skip, 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 speed. Look at if somebody's leaving ammo on the graveyard for some reason. It is coming in handy. I wonder if there is a sneak attack if we are stealthy. And then, like, walk up to them from behind, maybe? Dude, is that a brick? Uh-oh. Okay, none of them sees us. I said none of them sees us. Look at this beating eagles! Broskies, please don't. I have one healing. I'm using my last healing. Oh no. Okay, I gotta use my big my big gun. Okay, I am stuck in a dead end. Now Reload! 
Why did she say click and clicky when she didn't reload? No, 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 please. I can't believe we're always out of ammo at all times. We have, I have no healing now. You keep shining them with a flashlight. Yeah, but he has no eyes. He's literally made out of guts. How could he see my flashlight? I don't know. I think that was rigged. I think he was wall hacking. Pretty dang shitter. Uh... Panic! Or do we have to go through that? No. Healing items? We haven't found a single healing anywhere! Oh no. Somebody's meant to be a last resort. Yeah, I think maybe you're supposed to be stealthy much more often. But I try! <laughs> yeah. Hopefully we are safe in here. And nothing scary is waiting for us. It's blocked. Great. Well. Maybe we'll find some friends. Eight bullets. The game knows. The game knows I'm out of bullets. Could I also get some healing? This? That would be nice. Do we have to fight again? Are we gonna do a boss fight soon? I hear scaries. <gasps> Jovel. Kinda feels like boss fight area. Why scary noise? Okay, there's downstairs there. And ammo. There's a gnisling. Yuck! Katya, grab your spoon! We get the arm. We should be fine. And go in there. We can go here. Which also loads downstairs. There's somebody there. There's somebody there. There was somebody right there! Why is he so fast? Am I supposed to be sneaking down in these corridors? No, 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 no! No, 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 no! Ow! I am so dead. I am so dead. Why are you making noise? G visions as if you are dying. Oh my gosh, is there healing right there? Wh why? Stop! Reload! Please! Oh my gosh. He's making death noises! Oh my gosh, did I just miss 5 billion healing items in the middle here? <laughs> P.U. Okay. Oh, there was more than one in them. It was stacked. I still have three left now. Yeah, we got this chat. We got, we got this. Everything is fine. We're just gonna use our 7th save slot. Does this lead to the same place, you think? I don't think I like this sound. I'm gonna go to the other one. Felt a little friendlier. Ugh. Poaches. Um, hello? Any friendos here? That would like to become, I don't know, pin pals? I think we could have a good time. Oh no, the game... Did it do an autosave? Oh no. I'm literally playing Tomb Raider. Chat, it's us, Lara Croft. The Omen. 
A rustic plate adorned with lost allegory. Hmm. Just opening random coffins? Yes. You know, it could have been something useful in there. And apparently I'm gonna toss this somewhere. Ah! <laughs> Is he gonna come out? I'm just gonna run. Get, can I pick that up? Okay, everything is fine, chat. Tomb Raider four, was four years after this. <gasps> this came before Tomb Raider? This game basically invented all other games. Can I reload? All of my reloadable stuff? Okay. We're fine now. What? Stop! Why are you stay? Oh no, it's a boss fight! It is boss fight! He looks different than the others! He has like much more... This is like the double guy worked out a little bit. He's got... His arm is muscular. He's got muscles. Oi, oi, oi. I'm out of... I'm out of ammo. It's not going very great. The, the controlling this character... Oh, it can shoot so fast, though. I'm not doing great job. Uh, one more shot. Okay. Let the guy down. Ah, big boy! Ah! You have muscle arm. Can you not hit me, please? Kind of don't like that. Just grow more arms. Uh. Look, he looks like one big, one big le leech arm. Oh, Phew. that was one big leech arm, wasn't it? Any pen pals to have a good time with? <laughs> Matthew, listen. <laughs> Uh, Matthew, I just, you know, trying to stay positive. Maybe we can come out of this with, with newfound friends. Is a muted chicken wing with legs? Um, I don't know what kind of chicken wings you've been eating, but uh, Katya, I don't think they're supposed to look like that. Be careful. Um. Yeah. Where did he come from? Am I supposed to go back where he was? Oh, in here. Fancy floors. And the... Sewers. The people we met along the way, yeah. That was basically the what's his name? M Mut Mutanto. Was <laughs> the the one the one that is that you are fighting in Resident Evil Two? Yeah, whatever his name was. That guy. I almost said the Cinomorph. You don't do it. Yeah, you know that one. Okay. Uh, no matter which direction? Kind of not. <gasps> and looking behind her. <laughs> um, I thought I was gonna get saved and... Oh my gosh, it's the French catacombs. Not this again. Yeah, it seems like we're not getting out.
I have reloaded. I only have seven bullets. Maybe I should save though. Luciana was colonized by the French. <gasps> you think that they actually did bring? The Cantagon was with them too here. Maybe we just traveled to Paris. That could be it, right? Hello, don't mind me. Picking up some ammo. Thank you, I have now bullets. <sighs> those, some of those skulls are really big. Wait, don't think they look like human skulls? It could be our face, kinda, almost, maybe, perhaps? Well, compared to the bones, to be fair, they're kind of big. Maybe it's giants. <gasps> Croissant! Welcome home. We missed you. I know I speak for the whole, the whole family. Welcome back. We are yeah. ah! having a good time. Ew, he's... Oh, oh, did he spit them out? Oh my god, what? Why is there party? I did not consent to this. I am running. I am running. I am now running. Screw you all. I'm running. I'm running. Bye. I'm out of here. Goodbye. Good night. Goodbye. I am not having fun here anymore. Please and thank you. Goodbye. 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 Did he stop? Am I okay here? The music stopped. I think I should not go back and see if they're still there. I should just take the win. Fish Cory, thank you so much. For the one or five bits. <laughs> yeah, Carpal, now we're back to the slow walk. Thank you for the one for four bits. Thank you so much. Okay, you know what? Considering what just happened, I think it went pretty good. Okay, now we have more schools. Can we compare it? Look, aren't they kind of similar size? Maybe not. Maybe not that middle one. That one is extra big. Or it's just a really large-headed person. At least you weren't alone anymore. Lots of friends showed up. Yeah, do you think they all want to be my pen pal? Every single one of them? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe we're finally getting friends here. Yeah, maybe it's Big Man. Is that his name? The one from uh, ob uh, I'm on the observation duty. Ah, finally, the last medallion. They named Big Mac after him. Yeah, Big Mac. <laughs> they looked like writers for sure. Yeah, yeah, right. They had like extra many arms so that they can write extra fast. The sacrifice. What? You're sacrificing the gold? Is this what happened to the Capricorns? Oh no. A rustic plate. There we go. Yeah. She sounded so happy. Not a care in the world. We totally didn't just get chased by mega monsters, a party of them all. I heard a writer from Amnesia game directed and wrote this game. Oh, really? The first Amnesia? Yeah. I don't know, maybe the same person made the second one as well. <sighs> I made it out. Did I, are we shouting hello before we're over the river? I hear scary sounds. But I am gonna run. Just in case. Oh, oh, like... <sighs> hey you! Home oh, Stussy! Enjoy the soup! Happy popcorn and good vibes for a... Um, Mods? 
I had to think, how long does the Zoom last? <laughs> Happy having access to our emote for a month. Hope you like them. Welcome in! Shouting hello before you are over the river. Yay! Yes! Uh, Massacre, that's what we do in Sweden. Or rather, that we, we're trying not to do. Uh, in Sweden, we try to not shout hello before we are over the river. Um, it basically means uh, don't celebrate too early. Don't shout hello! Yay, I made it! Because you can still fall into the river and like get wet, I guess, before you are on the other side. Yeah. Sorry. I'm teaching you the Swedish uh, idioms. This is what we are here for. The educational channel. As a scene on TikTok. Education. Okay, how do we know which one is in what order? How do we... How do... How do... Did they just end up in the right order? No, 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 I do. Okay, no, that's not right. <laughs> that's not right. They're lining up with each other. Yeah, there we go. <sighs> okay. Getting there. Ah! Ruth? No! Katie! No! What was her name? Cass? Elisabetta? Elisabetta! Elisabetta. Emily, is that you? Jeremy! Yeah! What are you doing here? Our uncle, we found you him! You sounded so miserable in your letter. I've come to take you away from here. I can't believe I made such a foolish mistake. All I wanted was for His you accent. to stay away. What do you mean? I bargained with the dark man. A pact to keep Norland safe with my own life as tribute. No! The dark man isn't real, Jeremy. There is nothing he can do to hurt you. What do you mean? How you do just... you think any of this is happening? Yeah! How do you still not trust my words? <laughs> Just traveling through space and time. Let me help. Don't be foolish. He will bury you next to me in his sunken temple for an eternity. I don't care. I'll find a way. I have my own talisman and I know about Tarawaya. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Don't speak. Who's in here? Yeah, we just fought a mutant so zombie mommy and she's no still a skeptic. I know, right? He took your grandfather. No, I mean it. Who's in here? I can feel someone's in here. Are we getting cursed now too? Huh? Evelyn! I was just gonna say, please wake up in the place because I didn't... Uh, why do you want to go there, Jeremy? Oh no! I didn't collect all the- I didn't go to all the rooms. My everything. Clue. I've seen so many strange occurrences lately. Memories explode into existence and then burn out like tied glass bulb filaments. Dreamscapes crash down from the stars and sink into the sea. Doors that lead to nowhere and absolutely everywhere at once. With all this reverie, I want to think there's a chance that you found a way to remain alive in some way I cannot fathom. Hello. Just like I've learned to navigate with my talisman. Maybe you, with all your knowledge, you somehow knew a way. A way to find me again, perhaps in Tarawaya. Oh, my love. Jeremy. Um, luggage key found and lost. Yeah, we kind of did that in the reverse order. Um, 
That's probably to his own. I need to Luggage. find out more about Jeremy's pact with the dark man. He meant to go to Tarawea. Maybe there is something there that would help. Tarawea. Um. This is, doesn't sound very good. She was beautiful. I wonder what happened to her. How long has she been laying here? Hi, hi, hi! Vera Azur, thanks for coming in. Um. Letter. Look how much stuff we have. Aren't we still only in chapter two? Maybe there are only two chapters. I get confused because people kept saying that the game wasn't that long. And like, I feel like we've done a lot. Look at Jerusalem's fate remained a mystery to Emily. Was she a part of Jeremy's story? Or did she maybe have her own? Perosi, that's Elisabetta, right? The Starry yeah. Artist Colony. I'm pretty sure they had a Mardi Gras crew called the Pirates of Pontchartrain when I was a child. Elisabetta Perusi. Hmm. There's a lot to explore and find. I'm so happy to hear that. Because this game is great and I don't want to rush through it or want it to end or anything. Um. So Elisabetta... Jeremy said, called her my everything. He, so he and Elisabetta were involved. And Elisabetta is like a, there's something strange with her. Because she used to be with a bunch of people here that lived here. These people. And then suddenly a hurricane happened and all of them vanished. Uh, and now Elisabetta shows up like 15 years later and she looks the same age as when she disappeared. And it's like, oh, I'm Elisabetta. So we don't know what happened to her, how she got here through some hurricane that time traveled them. What's on her feet? I think it's just foot, feet. I mean, shoes. I think it is shoes. This game seems kind of Alan Wake, Alan Wake like. You know, there are some vibes similar, but you know, they're both survival horrors. Uh, there is some figuring out things to do. I do live in Sweden. Yes, yeah, again. I do indeed. Um. Where unlock Yermi steamer trunk? So is there anywhere else? Now it's purple again in Mezzanine's room. And there's something more in Perosi's room that we haven't figured out the uh, taken up. Some of these things turn purple again. Oh, just walking into it made it open. Cool. Uh, Michael, thank you so much for watching seven streams in a total. Thank you so much. Or in a row, I mean, not in a total. <laughs> you have much more than seven streams, I think. Yeah. Oi, that was a lag. I don't know what they want us to find in here. It says it's still pink. A lot of the rooms have turned pink again. Hmm. Extreme Apple fan, welcome in. I have some news I found out from my doctor. Good for every so I have to take medicine for it and eat different now. Oh no, extreme apple fan. I'm so sorry to hear that, but also it's great that you got that you went to the doctor and that they could tell you that. So that you can uh, um work on preventing things, right? It's always good to 
to sort things out before uh, or why as early as possible as early as possible um i'm going to the dentist next week and um that's also good to do to prevent. I, I kind of don't <laughs> like the idea, but, um, you know, it's always good to try to do things to prevent things from getting worse. It go I'm, yeah, I'm getting golden twos. Exactly. <laughs> getting gold grills. Uh... I guess uh, it's not really comparable, but um, the idea of uh, of uh, dealing with things as early as possible is applicable to a lot of things, I guess. Extra, t yeah, they're gonna add some more teeth. Is uh, that I definitely do need? Am I? race room is it, have i gotten a book or are they still stuff in here that i didn't pick up or are there new things that my biggest questions here i'll stream around twitch i watch i'll do not like dentist it will make you think well, the, the, I'm not afraid of the dentist. I'm not... It's more like I'm worried that I have been bad at flossing. So I'm worried that the dentist is gonna be like... We have some drilling to do. You know? Um, but I'm not afraid of going to the dentist per se, I guess. But right now I'm just like... Yeah, I kind of don't want to hear that. I kind of don't want them to go and drill. <laughs> If they need to. <laughs> Croissant! Thank you so much for watching 85. To every single stream since Halloween. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> every single stream since Halloween. Thank you, Croissant. Full yak in the box. I already got that. Yeah, look, now it's blue. I think I've gotten something weird. Because that was a Lagniape. Look, Yuck in the Box. We already found that one before. Hmm. Good night, I hope you feel bad. Good night, Nestle. Take care of yourself. Thank you for hanging now. Thank you. Everyone is bad at flossing. All dentists scold you for not flossing enough. I know. You know, but like, I don't know. <laughs> I'm worried. <laughs> I'm a little bit worried. <laughs> um, a Balmo is good at flossing compared to the rest of us all. Balmo is good at flossing. Hi, um, choo -choo. I didn't know things could respawn earlier. I guess they can. Um. Choo choo! Either way, uh, extreme Mappa fan, I, I wish you all the best. I, I'm glad to hear that uh, you can, uh, you have some, uh, gotten some guidance on how to navigate and uh, act in preventative, in preventative ways. Uh, also, sorry, I didn't mean to start talking about the dentist. Uh, I am actually so impressed by the fact that we have a. Reflection. You see this? Games don't usually do this. Kinda cool. Kinda cool. The only time my dentist told me everything looked great was after I had started smoking for the six months prior to going. Not sure what was that was about. What? Smoking made your teeth better? Hmm, there's something missing. Noticed after cinematic, some some rooms reset like they have been changed somehow by someone. Right. Yeah, but that was that looked the same. That still looked the same. I think.
I don't know if it's worth trying to go into the other places then. Luggage key. I guess we're just gonna immediately go to his luggage. No, there's one thing we haven't figured out yet. Let me actually go downstairs. There is one... Sorry about the laggy... Lagginess. There's this one place here. Okay. There's this one place here. There is a safe and I haven't been able to open it yet. Room key number six. We already found that one before. Okay, so this place is reset. Looks sturdy. Doubt I'll be opening this. Do I not think I will be opening it? This is that that's the only thing that we haven't really done yet, and I'm not sure. Maths? I'm not sure if I'm able to solve this one without um I need the key. I have a duplicate of the room key. Uh I'm not sure if there's a way to solve this already now or if I have to wait. I start Yuri duty tomorrow. Oh, I have to figure out what the heck they want me to do. Wait a minute, Yuri duty. Is that the one where you vote? On yes or no? How many digits? Yeah, I'll be opening this. My digits are usually in a in that thing. Smoking help kids you skinny. I think it satisfies your hunger or something. I'm not sure. I don't smoke. Yay yay o one. Wait, why are they all the same? Yay yay o one. Yay yay o one. L R zero zero. One. Hmm. That's where you get That's front. Yeah, I'll be opening this. Front row seats to a trial. There's nothing really that I think I can do. Maybe I can't solve this yet. Or it's like an optional thing. No smoking in chat? Yeah, key fog. I'm wondering if this is something optional. Um. <sighs> I feel like it must have something to do with the drawers here. Because they have numbers on them. Why does that one have an X instead of a letter? This is definitely looks sturdy. Yeah, I'll be opening this. An optional? I say definitely. I'm not sure. X is a letter. Yeah, but the other ones are numbers here. I I dim I'm not a letter. I mean not a number. X O O. The problem is here. Looks sturdy. Yeah, there is no X. This. X one eleven twelve. 
Oh, this goes from 12. One. Looks sturdy. Doubt I'll be opening this. Is this a social media platform? Nobody says X. <laughs> I don't care that they rebranded. It's Twitter in my eyes. He is R R R T J J. Is it the amount of drawers that are s rolled out? But they are at zero. What? Why did? Would that matter? Was a car in game? Did you hear a car? I'm, there are strange things in the background, but I'm not sure what it is. Will the game not give us a thing? I mean, I did put it on old school, so maybe that's why. But w would we not get a single little thing here? not get a single thing in the room to find wait what did this one say only dot tuesday dot 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 I... i'm not sure maybe we're not able to do this i'm just kind of worried that like i'm going towards main story finishing up and that that won't be... I don't want to finish it. I, I, I want to, I mean... I want to be able to do this locker if I can, before I, I should. Two... Digits that these kind of lookers have before, usually. Hey, lookers, what are these called? Safes. In movies, when they move them around, it feels like they do it like three times, but that doesn't make sense. Unless. Is it three times? <laughs> three. Where is the columns? Three, four, five. Three, five. Three. Three, five, three. That's, That's the sign of. I'll be opening this. Three. Five. Three. It doesn't even do a click. How are you supposed to know when you're doing it right? Can we very different based on the look? Maybe it's something that we can't do yet. Yeah, we had a document that we did find here. But... It was the patient files. These ones. Room number eight. Mm okay. Mm -hmm. Seven. These ones have a bunch of different numbers on them. One, six, two. Why do they have them in different orders? Have we tried shooting it? Or shooting the the look? That would be terrible security if it did. But it's a video game, Merlish. In video games you they can they can click. Eight seven one six two. 
Maybe it's just the order of these ones. 87162. Maybe, maybe it's that easy. Maybe I'm making it hard on, uh, again. Like, like I did before. Remember? 87162. 87162. And it has five letters? Looks sturdy. Doubt I'll be opening this. How would I know? Um... Eight, seven, one, six, two. The look is so secure that nobody has ever finished the game. I don't know if this is part of the main quest or the main story. I think this might be an optional thing. Or maybe I'm supposed to do it later. Uh, Ruth... The medicine. It should be the document that we found here. I feel like. You finished the game just now? Nice, Avi! I hope you enjoyed it. It is a hacking great... Uh, hacking great time, I think. No, but look, there's also this, like, lens thing... There's the thing about the... Um, this is the other thing. Maybe we don't have what we need here. Emily's 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 here. Maybe we don't have what we need. Maybe we need a talisman. What if it's the number that we wrote down in the beginning yesterday? Oh, oh. Sturdy. Doubt I'll be opening this. Miley is here. <laughs> Miley? Dang, everyone's here apparently. Miley and Emily? <laughs> wow. Thank you, Search Query, for the hundred beats. Where the heck? How did I lose a note? The note that I used yesterday when I literally have nothing on my keyboard. On my desk. I cleaned my desk and it's all fresh and so empty. I have no idea. Did I drop it on the... How did I... How did I lose my notes from yesterday? It was like... It was like three... Three, five, eight. Three, five, eight. Didn't work either. <laughs> it didn't work either. Okay, I'll I'll get back to this because I doubt that this will be well. If that was the last one, I need to save here, and we will remember it. number nine. Is where we can go back. If I accidentally beat the game now or something. We can go back there and un try to unlock that thing. Cabinet. Everything that shines won't always be gold. Now that is true. Maybe we don't want that scene that safe anyway. Maybe it's just leeches. Lugig's key. Barlow lens. Oh, let's go. It was a lens. That can be fixed to amateur telescopes to increase magnification. It's a telescope lens. Yeah. Well, why would he lock it in here? I have no idea. But let's go to the drawing room. Is that downstairs? Oh. Drawing room. We are downstairs. Library. <gasps> we got in there. To the corridor. Down the stairs. Library. Here. No, 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 no. <laughs> Almost didn't make it through. Through here? Wait a minute. There's something here. 
Wait a minute. Wasn't there anything? There is something out here, though. No. Is it all of the ones that were empty? No. Huh? You should. Some of them were empty before, and now it feels like I found things in them. Maybe that's it. Downstairs. Uh oh, laggies. Library. Where did Ruth go? I thought she was kind of chill. <gasps> Look, it's an eagle! <laughs> <laughs> An actual eagle. Okay. I think this is where the telescope was. Yes. And now we can put the lens on it. What? Oh! There we go! That's the one that was marked on the map! Library! Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Find the talisman coordinates. Oh, that was it. Wait, am I just gonna travel there now? Oh no. Someone sat in the library for so long they became petrified. Yeah, exactly, Ehrlich. I didn't realize that you could uh, go sideways. Okay. Why is Lottie's room red again? I have to go all the way around. I hope there is... I'm not mess... No, 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 no. We haven't even gotten the chance to go downstairs to the stairwell in infirmary. I'm just starting to get worried that, like, what if I beat the game without getting all the things that I wanted to get? I cannot rotate this. Whoa, whoa, it's a raid! Come it's on. a party! Whoa, party, whoa. party! Yo! Is that Arva? Look at you go. Thank you so much for coming in and reading. What the heck? Saima, hello! Welcome in! Thank you so much for joining. Arva, how was your stream? Thank you for bringing your peeps over. Thank you for reading in here. How was the Invincible? Wow. What is that? I don't think I've heard about it before. Did you have a good time? Uh, welcome in, readers. Welcome, welcome. Hello and hi. Welcome to us playing... A little, a little game called Alone in the Dark. 947. What? Is it doing it on its own now? What's going on? It's entering the numbers by itself? Okay, uh, great, so where is that? <laughs> Couldn't it have done this on its own? Before, I mean? It sucked, had horrible graphics issues. Oh no, I'm so sorry, Ara. Invisible looks amazing, but like the gameplay. Complete follow the story that unfolds game. Constant talking. Oh no, does that makes it hard to like take breaks? Oh no, I'm sorry to hear that, Ara. Uh, I don't know if I've heard about the game. If it's maybe a new one? I missed out on it? Didn't hear? I'm sorry, you didn't have a good experience. Wait, I recognize this... The... Um... The, like, the art from it. I think I saw it on a trailer, maybe? Or in, on game, the Game Awards or something? Perhaps? I'm sorry, Ara. Have you been playing this game, though? 
maybe um maybe this could be something to look into next if you're into this kind of games this came out this week but although it has a little bit of performance issues for me right now in the on the pc version but there is a um uh, the console version seems to be very stable right now. Yeah, it's a new one. They're, it's a remake of the original. Uh, or, well, I haven't played the original, so I don't know how, how alike they are. But it's supposedly a remake of the 1992 game. And uh, somebody said earlier that it's more of a, maybe a reimagined version. It was this one, wasn't it? No. The heck, do we have to go to every single every single fireplace in the in the place? Hmm. Was this dream of Tarawea without a catch? Yeah. A place for rest and comfort. The talisman has shown that the gate will be open will open in the dining room. Did it really say that? I didn't even know. Yeah, look into the PS5 edition. It, it it is controller friendly. There is some gameplay uh, of sh of this though. It's a hor horror survival game. So if you're not into spoopies, but there are some similar similar elements too. I love Wake. I know you enjoy that. Um, not not that much, you know. But there is some similarities. Uh, uh, and just like horror survival in general, a lot of Resident Evil vibes. Um, I do recommend it. I'm having a great time with it. I'm gonna heal actually while we're at it. Bloop. Um, Sora, thanks for sticking around until now. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful sleep. Take care of yourself. Thanks for coming over with your peeps. Appreciate it so much. Thank you. Have a wonderful sleep. Night, night. And tense for spooky redeems. Exactly. Uh, dining room. Dining room. That's that one. From the stairs. The talisman has shown that the gate will open in the dining room. Okay, I guess we're going to the dining room. I hope I won't be missing other things. Hmm. Is it soon? At certain point. Wait. What does this mean? Take care, Calumbra! Thanks for hanging out! Don't answer n yes, won't spoil more. Oh, what am I missing? Oh, yeah, okay. Hmm, interesting. Hmm. I wonder if choices and like how much you collect and stuff, if that has an impact on the game, how things go. If there are different ways of playing the game. Now this one is back again. Are you serious? <laughs> it got closed again and my key got consumed last time? I don't know if this is a bug or not. I'm not sure. Iska, welcome! Uh, I don't think I looted anything from that locker before. Shot good. Ah! Somebody peed on the floor, chat. Was it you? Ooh, and roaches. You only good, school. Speaking of pee on the floor, I think I actually got... I'm gonna go pee. It was Masaker and Yuvia. I can't believe you've done this. I can't believe you've done this. No, I'm not gonna... <laughs> no peeing on any floors, chat. Okay. In the meantime, keep an eye out, okay? Keep it <laughs> together? I how much more I'm gonna... Gonna know. Zoe, thank you for lurking. Thank you. Give me one second, chat. 
I'm having so much fun with this game. This is so good. This is so good. So, I'm gonna go real quick. Hi, Yoni! Thanks for coming by. Also, bye, Yoni. Oh, I'm no, I'm joking. I'm just gonna go to the toilet real quick. Give me a minute. Can I own her? Maybe fine. And my axe. Nice.
Yeah. Are you doing a hype train? <laughs> I got a little hungry. Oh, I got a little hungry, so I wanted to make sure that I had a, something to eat, but I could only find a corny. Uh, yeah. Oh, banana, corn. Diarysis, diarysis, I diarysis, sedilla, diarysis, diarysis, sedilla, diarysis, 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 sedilla, diarysis, diarysis, I diarysis, sedilla, diarysis, diarysis, sedilla, diarysis, 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 sedilla, thank you. You're welcome. Chair hype chain? Am I ruining it? I'm so sorry. I was gonna see if there was something a little nicer to eat than a corny, but not a corny, it's not nice, but I thought it could be something less sugary. Uh, for um, so I don't get too uh, pig. I almost said. <laughs> uh, excuse me. Thank you so much for uh. Yay! Hype train. How long has this been ongoing? Wait, how long was I gone for? I'm so sorry. Thank you for the 360 beat croissant. Do you beat Kaborg? What have you been doing? Thank you, L5, thank you for gifting five subs into the chat. You don't get grease grease? Yeah, pink pink. Pink pink pink. Thank you so much for all the beats of Arva, thank you for the beats of Carapel, thank you for the 69 beats. Trisha Corey, thank you for the 104. Thank you so much, L5, thank you for gifting five subs into the chat. Zoe, thank you for the beat. Uh, Trisha Corey, thank you for gifting three subs into the channel. Eilish, thank you for 100 beats. Thank you so much, everybody. What the heck? Thank you so much. How worth mentioning my two-bit poke- What do you mean, Arva? That's two bits that you cheered in the channel. You could have cheered zero bits. And you- That is still two bits. Thank you for two bits. Thank you very much. Um. How do we say your name? You can just say Hecky. Just say Hecky. And that's, uh... That's uh, uh, what everybody says. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Just saying hecky. Yeah, hecky. Uh, Luna Wintermoon also, thank you for coming in. Okay, have you, did, I, did you see anything? I, I can't leave you alone for, for five minutes. Grabbing a snack and going to pee. And you make a hype train. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> For a level 4 hype train. What the heck? Thank you. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm... If I dare... Oh. Hopefully it won't... The game won't end or anything. If I go and do what they say, tell me to do. They say I'm gonna go to a gate. That sounds kind of... Like... Sounds like it's... That's it, you know? But hopefully it's not... Maybe. Save game. Did I say number nine is the one? Okay. We maxed out our save files. I had a nature valley ball at 3 Bar at 3 a.m. Oh, last night on sort of hecky. Oi, 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 oi. Um, that is a... Thank you. What an honor to be associated with nature bars. Or granola bars in general, I guess. Yeah, again, good night. Oh, this is how close we were to the chapter change. Oh my gosh, what's happening? Tofro, thank you for coming by. You should not have come, Emily. How do you know my name? Have it, we met? In a manner of speaking. As a manifestation of Yermi's deepest desires, I am to you unfamiliar. Yet I know of you. Are you Jeremy? What? Is that what you're saying? I am only his subconscious thoughts. I cannot speak Yermy. for his totality. How come you have a Spanish accent? <laughs> and what is this place? Is this Tarawea? This is See, you can ask people why they have an accent. Tarawaya, where Yermi goes to find peace during his sessions with Dr. Gray. It's all fantasy then. Based on the things he has read and seen. 
And that includes you. It's Sierra yes. Madre. My name is Juan Luis Jorge. Jeremy once read a book of mine. It stuck with him. Oh. Can you help me break the pact with the Dark Man so we can leave Dorsetto? Jeremy doesn't want you to. He wants to honor his word to the Dark Man. Why? What's the point? I don't understand what the pact is for. The people of Derseto are calling upon evil to enter this world. It's a bit hard to read the text. Your uncle offered his soul to the Dark Man to contain this disaster. What? No, that doesn't make any sense. The pact will be fulfilled at dawn. As the sun rises, Jeremy will forever be entombed in his sunken desert temple. As promised, the Dark Man shall quarantine and starve the evil inside Derseto. What about all the patients but, and the staff? Yeah, everybody else they is stuck inside. <gasps> it's unacceptable. How could Jeremy agree to this? Yeah, Desperation, right? Desperation, of course. Jeremy did not choose martyrdom lightly. But the eldest didn't sign up to be martyrs. Well, nothing is lost yet. I'm sure I can find a way to break the pact and save Jeremy. <laughs> yeah, and hopefully the people too. at Dorsetto. What even is this evil you're talking about? I don't know much. I think some nightmarish entity from the bayou. We'll just have to deal That's... with that later. First, I have to get Jeremy out of his deal. What? Did you run out of arguments? You are actually happens? quite inspiring, Miss Emily. Huh? If we put Jeremy's feelings aside, I would have to say I agree with you. Really? You might this is very Alan Wickish, yeah. From himself. I think you should take a look in the convent library. Try to find the truth about Jeremy's relationship with the Dark Man. Okay. You should know that you won't library. be alone in those grand halls. The Dark Man has been reading those books for years. He's... He's been here? reading them? You'll have to be very careful. How? Of course. I... I can be careful. I think this is Good Alan? Luck, Miss Emily. What? Alan in the dark. Somewhere else entirely. Yeah, look where we're at. I guess we can take a look around. Uh, I feel like we are in such a nice, pretty place. I feel like I don't want to leave this. Right? I greet you, people. Wow! Bogda, give welcome. Greetings to you. Thanks for joining. <laughs> greetings, greetings. Um. Oh. Movie time. Is there? A, oh, are you gonna watch a movie now? Oh, look how mossy. Oh, this is beautiful. Also. I didn't get the lag by going through the door. Success. Success. Oh. Oh, okay. I was so happy for a moment. People that have studied English actually sound better than us who just grew up with it. You think so? But I didn't even know what all Good those... Night. I hope you feel bad. Words she said yesterday meant. Good night, Elish. I hope you sleep well. I didn't even see that Elish said good night. We're going down. <sighs> Walk a little further. I would like to see a little more. You have to thank Sora. Oh, you came with the red. Nice. Yeah, uh, this is where you got dropped off. For some scary scaries. Apparently, today is scary times. Well, it doesn't feel so scary anymore, considering where we're at. But... Uh, Wow, this is beautiful. <gasps> wow! This is gorgeous. I was
was just like, oh yeah, a pool and some lighting. There's a whole freaking window there. <gasps> Icky angel. <laughs> Beautiful. Have you enjoyed Alone in the Dark so far? Heard mixed review. Have you really? I've had a lot of fun. I'm enjoying this a lot. I'm having a great time with it. Definitely no mixed review on my end. Well, I'm having a bit of like performance issues, but other than that, great. Is this person also petrified? <gasps> Do you think it's actually for real people who got petrified? Don't blink, chat. Oh. An honest day's work. Play for more than eight hours. Oh, chat, we just broke the eight hour mark in the game. Wow. That's nice. The game gives you, like, an achievement for that. Yeah, right? We got an achievement for being a gamer? Wow. Just need some cleaning and I would this would be a decent place to yeah, just a decent place to live. Actually, honestly, imagine power washing this place. Imagine power washing <laughs> all this green goo. I'm getting the Last of Us vibes just because it's like one of them overgrown kind of uh, areas. It doesn't really look like this. Got more modern stuff, I guess. The towers? Why am I not in bed? <laughs> because you want to hang out with us. Yeah, and it's a good time. Yeah. Oh my gosh, look, it's one of them dolls. They were around a hundred years ago? Hmm. Stalker vibes from here. Quick, throw a washer on a string into the middle distance. A washer? Like a washing machine? The Great Library Clue. The Great Library it was endless, beautiful, and terrible. An Akashic record for the universe inside the mind of Jeremy Hotwood. Now corrupted by a story forced upon him, told by a maniacal liar. Maniacal? Evil. Conjured by science and secrecy. I will suspend a room and lock away the foundation of his character. Its key will be left to the librarian. The only thing invisible to the Frowler. Hey. Suspend a room and lock away the foundation. The hidden room? Confusion. I am... Uh, I'm not sure if I want to leave this level because it's so pretty. <laughs> it's so pretty. I like it. If the Warhammer 40k Power Wash game doesn't win game of the year, I'm here calling here say, What? Warhammer 40k Power Wash? What is that? My throat is making noises. I think these were people. I if I if I wanted part of me would like to see if I can like attack it or punch it and if it will break, but that will feel really sad if they were actually real people that we could maybe bring back to life. So we're not gonna do that. But that would be an interesting thing to test. Also blood! I start at 2pm, that's why I'm not in bed. Going to spin on Thursday? <gasps> Yo, you going on vacation? Vacay. I hope it's gonna be a good hacking time. Enjoy. Uh-oh. But, 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 well, aren't we in Spain already now? Here? 
Isn't this Spain? Oh. Thanks. The key of Hubertus. After the suspended room was built, the, its key was given to the convent librarian Hubertus to keep Jeremy's darkest secret safe from prowling eyes. Oh no! Wait, I wasn't done exploring! Oh no. Oh, that's the elevated room. Oh no! My health is dying! That was like Dark Souls. Did you see how fast our, our HP just went from smoke? My health is dying. It was depleting. Not most recent save. You know what? I don't know when it. Is it an auto save, maybe? Hopefully? I sure as heck did not sleep. Okay, it saved here. So if I take that cross, he will appear. Maybe we should be careful with that. There's something missing. Oh, I bring the cross and drag it over there immediately. Okay. Yep, yep, I know. Hubertus, come out. And goodbye. No, that was my first death in the game, by the way. Who better just please? It's the dark it's so loud. It's so loud. I'm going down. Is he upstairs? Oh, it's all smoky where he's hanging out. Oh, she's gonna come downstairs. Where? 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 No, 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 Stuck in a corner. He teleported. Oh no. I think I'm screwed. Okay, I can just run through him apparently. Oh no, but I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm dying very much dying. Where do I go? Was I not supposed to go back? Shoot, don't tell me I was supposed to go upstairs. At least I find the healing. Oh 
Okay, maybe we're supposed to go up. I don't really know where the... Oh, we're supposed to go up, up. But he made everything smoky. Chat, sorry about that. Ah, he's right there. Eh, eh. Ah! I insta die. I think it auto saves as we progress in this place, though. Yeah, look, it's saved right up here. Okay, and then my we go here. That's a dead end. <gasps> Something in there. Oh, what? I was scared by the statue. Okay, I'm gonna do this. And hope for the best. What did I just do? Oh. It's so loud. It saved, it saved, it saved. again he even stopped going downstairs wow that we did it wow oh my gosh it's that one <gasps> that was in yim's room y yim's son's room uncle yim uncle yim's room I hope me dying won't have a bad ending now. I'm cutting st I'm kind of starting to worry that there is like different endings. And then what do you do? Smoking. Ah, here we go. Here we go. I would like a quick word with the audio engineer who worked on this part. You mean because it was so loud? <laughs> Key chat. It's all good now. All good. We got it. It was in the hot autumn that I went through the night with the restless crowds. He was a kind of itinerant showman who held forth in public halls and aroused widespread fear. The New Orleans address of the event is lost, but I remember distinctly the Prext Shipping Company pressing their contribution. What did you say? Oh no, there's somebody in the background. Emily! Oh, it was a friend. <gasps> Let's see, there was a, somebody in the background. Oh no. Uncle James! Please, no. I hope you found what you were looking for, Emily. I fear there is no going back. No, couldn't you have told me that head earlier? Head His breath replacing mine. <laughs> you should not have come and Juan is gonna poke her eyes out. <sighs> that was quite the hat, yeah, very tall hat. Wait, what just happened? <gasps> Ruth! Well, if it isn't my new best friend. Hi. Come. Join me for some giggle water. Uh, Omar, what's well, welcome in. You're not the first one to say that. Oh, Miss Hartwood, don't tell me you've been out swinging without me. Ruth, what is this place? Where are we? Have you never been to the Maccabean before? 
Goodness like a bean? Me. Tell me, Miss Hartwood, have you ever considered going out for an evening? Are we in New Orleans? Oh, who can tell anymore? I just went inside the grand parlor and suddenly here I am. Are we at a nice hotel in Jack Nicholson's still dead? Can we get back to Dorsetto from here? <laughs> really? Are you sure you want to? We could stay here and drink the night away. How about a gin fizz? Do I have a girlfriend now? Oh this my! New Orleans. Maybe I should go further. Find that magic show the book was talking about. But there was no address, just Preg's shipping company. She's not like, oh, what just oh, happened? I came from the elevator with my... Met the dark man? With my uncle. How do you know about that? Oh no, with Juan. <laughs> Jeremy talked a lot about the dark man. I always felt a bit envious. How so? If an all-powerful entity showed me any interest, I'd at least hear him out. I'm sure he has plenty to offer. I don't think you'd want that, Ruth. You're too sweet for such darkness. <laughs> oh, please. What kind of blue nose do you take me for? I relish the darkness. I think it suits me. <laughs> hmm. You don't happen to know how to find the Preg's shipping company, do you? Preg's? Of course. Their office is just over there. Whoa, what happened? You just got lucky. <laughs> A biento, Mademoiselle Emily. Hey, do you okay. know where my uncle is? No, but I bet you're close. Okay, matchbook, like nyape. Wow, the Crescent City. Now we have show bonus text. New Orleans, le oh wait. New Orleans lies southwest of Erceto, along the great Mississippi River. It's one. It's Old Town, the French Quarter, or the Vieux Carré, is home of the proud and often rich Creoles. Wrapped around this center, you will find a large and eclectic city full of people, including the most mundane dock workers, Reckless gangsters, jazz crazed flappers, and of course, jazz? the mysterious voodoo people. At night, you can stand on the lakeside of their seto and watch New Orleans glow like embers on the horizon. Wow. From all the streetlights? Oh, wow. Um. The Croissant City, yeah! This full moon, beware of what wolves? What wolves? Yeah, you better be actually watching out. We all better be watching out. No, we have three sets completed. This is way too little. I don't think we're like that close. We're not like at the very end of the game. We're only in chapter three. Maybe there are like five, perhaps? I took definitely extra long time on those... Uh, Pendant puzzles yesterday. Definitely. Um, you have city. Good night, Jordan. I hope you sleep well. Catch you later, maybe next week. You know where to find this. One one. They did say something about. Yeah, they exactly. They did say something about that. Some of these were um. We wouldn't be able to finish the sets unless we play a run f uh, through of of uh, with the Mr. Barnaby, Barn Barnaby, Barkyby, with him. So um, I guess we can't get all of them, but it doesn't feel like we've gotten half. We've gotten three out of fifteen sets completed, and a lot of them are at zero out of three. So. Unless he's like the collector guy and he will get all the collections. What sure. Also, I didn't give him a hand. Nice. Choo choo. Choo choo. What? Oh. 
Shoot, what did they say? Why couldn't Ruth come with her and help her out? Yeah. In the thought? She really didn't want to be alone. In the dark. At least Emily was back in New Orleans again. Are in we front though? of the warehouse of the Prext Shipping Company. According to the book in the library, she should find the address to where Jeremy first met the dark man inside. But Jeremy wasn't the first one to meet with him, though. Was he? Like... Didn't they say that this is a curse that has been, like, running in their family for years? I feel like it was... I feel like it was something that... That they said they were... They were like looking for to see if they, they I don't I don't I feel like Emily was like, oh yeah, maybe I can find a cure her hair because they have been struggling for so long. This is something that it keeps happening or something. Um but I don't know. Um I'm wondering if we did start a little bit earlier to this. So it feels like weird, like what? We're already We've already been live for this many hours. Uh, but I don't know how much longer this uh, will proceed. Um, we just started chapter three. Oh, the dark man enters. It was in the hot autumn that oh. I went through the night with the restless crowds to witness the enigmatic black pharaoh. He was a kind of itinerant showman who held forth in public halls and Aroused widespread fear wherever he performed. You know what this is? <laughs> the sort of thrills my father sought out. Especially if there was a promise of electrical trickery. The Norland's address of the event is lost, but trickery. I remember distinctly the Prext Shipping Company pressing their contribution in the morning papers. There were rumors of an Egyptian sarcophagus being a part of the act. <laughs> <gasps> Something oh, no. which kept me wondering how I'm they late, but hi, hi, the hi, what's your plan? Stairs. The details of the showman's performance have almost been entirely replaced by dread. The kind that numbs and hides the terror of something Wait. unbearable. What is certain is that ever since that night, I can't remember a single day passing without seeing or sensing the presence of a dog. Man. Are they talking about the does the, does this mean that does it, does this does this mean that he got possessed by some ancient devil spirit that came out of the sarcophagus? Is that what happened? He went to this thing and they were like brought him out and he got stuck to him, a curse? Um Spills Inventor, thank you so much for coming by. Thank you for the nine months of being subscribed. This is a brand new badge for you. I hope you like it. Pink Good popcorn night, next to your name. Bad. Uh, thank you so much for the nine months. We've been playing a game called Alone in the Dark today. Um, and uh, it's been really good. I've been having a lot of fun with this. Uh, this has been really, really cool. Prague's Shipping Company. According to the book in the Great Library, they assisted a showman performing somewhere in New Orleans. It's somehow connected to Jeremy's New Orleans. introduction to the Dark Man. I'm sure I can find the address inside. Hmm. Um. I think it's moving things around. Um. All this may have been avoided if Jeremy. Yeah, G Jeremy. No, but I. So what I don't know if is it has been a curse in the family for a long, much longer time than what it is now, but I'm not sure. I just started the dust game from Goog and I killed that one anyway by pushing the chest into him because I was too slow. What? Oh, you managed to do that? Whoa, whoa, GG! You're hacking the game, Hodor. Um, I think we're gonna do this because it's... Oh no, we've saved our... All of our 10 save files. We're gonna have to start overwriting now. I'm writing over the number two save the game. New Orleans Riverside. Oh no, it doesn't say 11. 
I'm just gonna have to remember. I guess we'll have to look at the dates and be like, hmm, which one is the latest? The old those versions are so cheap on gold. Yeah, they're on sale right now. They're like 60 cent or whatever people said. Apparently very uh, a bargain. Very a bargain. Um I think though that since I uh, have uh, an early morning tomorrow, I say early, it's not early, but it's early for me. Um, I have some uh, um, errands tomorrow. And uh, we didn't start earlier today than we did before, so we've actually been live for over five hours. That's pretty good. Pretty good. Gosh, we got so spoiled today by raids. Holy quaps. Um, a bargain. Yeah, bargain. Uh, so I think this is a good time for us to save and uh, go and say hi to someone. Before we go to bed. Ooh, ooh. Um, is there anyone that we can go and be like... A little hi to that we haven't said hi in a while, or maybe somebody new. Well, this is a good thing to round off a mm, scary time with, I think. Maybe, um, this could be nice. Are we crashing a party? Is this inappropriate? We can go in here. Uh, Nodelin, thank you so much for coming over. Thank you for catching the end of the stream. Thank you. I'm glad you managed to see us a little bit. Um, I think this is where we drop us off. Um, and we're gonna go say hi to somebody and give, do a little red. But thank you so much for hanging out. Thank you if you have been here lurking tonight. Uh, thank you if you've been hanging out after one of the many reds. We've gotten so spoiled tonight with so many reds. Absolutely ridiculous. Um, absolutely ridiculous. Uh, thank you if anybody has stuck around from any of the reds. Thank you all the new people who came by tonight. Um, thank you if you've been lurking. Thank you mods for modding. Thank you for all the new follows. Wow. What a thank you everybody for joining us. Um, I will stop with you. I'll stop it. Stop it. You have your headphones connected to your headphones? No, the headphones are free. I They are wireless. <laughs> My headphones are wireless. Um, thank you, Liam. Thank you for still being around. Thank you, everybody. Uh, this has been lovely. I am so excited to continue this game. Um, we won't be able to continue it until Wednesday. Because we're actually not streaming for two days now. But we will continue it on Wednesday. Hopefully, Ehrlich and all the other people who are not here because they didn't want to get spoiled have lots of time to get ahead now and uh, can uh, catch up Maybe even beat the game and then they can be here without any problematics. Um, if you missed out on the vote yesterday and you want to see the start of this game, it is up on YouTube already on our vote channel. And uh, if you want to see this one, I'm going to upload it on YouTube and it's probably going to get up either Monday or Tuesday. So tomorrow or the day after. Um, if you want to re-watch it, thank you if you, anybody has been watching on YouTube right now. If you're hearing me right now on YouTube, thank you for watching this. Thank you very much. I can't wait to continue this game. This is so good. Um, we're gonna... Oh my gosh, they just got a raid. Okay, we're gonna join in on somebody who is raiding uh, a person that I thought we were gonna raid. Uh, let's join the raid train. Now we are uh, running over to... We have actually never raided here before, but she has been by... She has come by the stream. You might have seen her in chat. Uh, we are both on the Twitch uh, Women's Guild. And she's a music streamer. She is a music streamer and um, does a lot of piano. And... Uh, uh, 
is playing currently video game music. So, to the tunes of this uh, game right now. It's Arilina, yeah! To the tunes of this wonderful uh, game right now. We're gonna go on a raid. Let's go listen to some video game music. Uh, shall we? Let me see. R -E -D. R -E 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 -E. Ah. Let's go on a raid. Uh, chat behave, we have never been there before. <laughs> but let's say hi. She just got a raid. There is a raid party going on right now. Let's go and add on top of it. Uh, let's join the party. I'm not sure if they're playing Ballads or... or... Oh, Unyielding from Halo 2 is currently on playing, I think. Let's listen to some video game music. Um, thanks so much for being here, everybody. Yeah, feel free to grab a raid message. Either the one with subscriber emotes if you want to, or the one with global popcorn emotes if you want to join in on the raid and post those in the chat as we go raiding. Um, thank you so much for being here. What a night! Thank you so much! Um, so many new faces, so many familiar faces. Thank you all for being here. Thank you for lurking. Thank you for chatting. Thank you for hanging out. Thank you for being here through this journey with me. I am having a lot of fun with this game. I can't wait to continue it on Wednesday. Uh, so that's when the next stream will happen. If you are not in Discord, feel free to join us. It is lurker friendly. You won't get called out when joining, so... Feel free to join us there. You can get uh, updates about the stream and pings when we go live, etc. I don't, I don't ping everyone, but like if you want to get pinged, you can choose to get pinged. Um, yes, I hope you have a wonderful start of the new week, um, a wonderful rest of your day tonight, a rest of your night and your time zone, wherever you are. Thanks for hanging out, everybody, and I'll see you around. Stay popcorn, bye bye, bye.